Hallo? 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 A very good morning to one and all present here. Success is the journey that you take, the effort that you put in each day. It is the willingness to pursue. When obstacles are in your way, success is the courage to try, to take risks and to dream big. It is the strength to get back up when you fall and to never quit. Great achievements are but the accumulation of conquered difficulties. To do just a little more and a little bit better is the secret of achieving excellence. At SNS family, we believe that we as a society are at a defining point in time, a time that future generations shall look back with admiration and be inspired to create an even greater future. SNS institution is the first Indian institution to implement and patent design thinking curriculum in education. SNS opts to sign as one of the premium engineering institutions in the state recreated by NAC with highest A++ grade for seven years and has secured a high place in NIRF ranking. SNS strive to deepen the knowledge and gear up the governance of world-class teaching and learning for building an entrepreneurial culture. SNS CT stands as a testament to the power of education and the impact it can have on transforming lives. It is a place where students from all walks of life come together to pursue their dreams, to learn, to explore and to challenge themselves. SNS has become a hub of excellence in education, research and innovation. SNS's culture defines it all as purpose, process and people. It is a culture of student-centeredness that governs every action at SNS and is key to its founding philosophy of building and nurturing a community of lifelong learners in an environment of literacy and critical thinking who can contribute substantially as value producers to the larger societal well-being. With this note, we welcome the Excellency, esteemed Chairman, prestigious Correspondent, Distinguished Technical Director and Native Design Thinker, Respected Director, Honorable Principal and Vice Principals, renowned guests and deans and heads of various departments, press and media and my beloved friends and fellow comrades for the 22nd Annual Day Celebration. As we celebrate our Annual Day today, we do so with a deep sense of knowing that we are a part of a community that values education, diversity and excellence. Once again, we cordially welcome you all for the Annual Day Celebration 2024. Prayer is a universal language that transcends all barriers and brings us closer to our inner selves and to the divine. It is a way to express gratitude, seek guidance and find solace in times of need. Now we call upon Shruti and Karishma Shruti of second year to chant the voice of PD and take us one step closer to him. Inspire us to be a light for others. A woman of great virtue. 
with great leadership qualities a woman of immense ideas and a heart that welcomes all a woman of great inspiration she helps students to focus on their studies she makes them grow and glow to become great achievers all call her correspondent but we call her beacon excellence she is dr s rajalakshmi ma'am indeed she is the embodiment of excellence now we will have a traditional auspicious lamp lighting ceremony as a tribute to our god almighty we request dr s rajalakshmi ma'am and all the dignitaries on the dais to step forward to light the lamp and spread the spark of joy on this fabulous occasion something which cannot be bought or measured with money that is sincerity and integrity and yeah now i can think of a person who seems to be the most sincere with a vibrant smile i call upon our vice principal administration dr p tamil silvam sir to welcome the gathering a warm greetings to one and all present here I am extremely privileged and honored to have this opportunity to welcome you all at this important moment of celebrating our 22nd annual day today. Our college has a great potential to bring out young talents, shape them into perfection and provide empathetic citizens to the society. The objective of SNS is not only to teach academics but also to mold the students with great qualities of life. we come together not just to celebrate an event but to cherish the spirit of unity resilience and creativity that defines us this annual day is a reflection of the collective efforts passions talents that makes our institution vibrant and exceptional we have traversed another year filled with challenges trumps and invaluable experiences each milestone achieved each hurdle overcome has contributed to the growth and success of our college our journey has been fueled by the unwavering support of our management constant backing by our principal dedication of our staff and the relentless enthusiasm of our students today we are here to honor their commitment and applaud their contributions on behalf of our sns college of technology i cordially welcome our chief guest sri gnv subarao global head of operations abb bangalore for our 22nd annual day function he is a renowned leader in industry with over 30 plus years of experience in abb who is passionate about automation in power systems trained many young engineers as team lead and have successfully completed various projects for the past 3 decades we are really honored to have you here amongst all of us with again your busy schedule hearty welcome to you sir our next welcome goes to guest of honor sri s chandrasekharan associate director cts coimbatore he is a leading a business at cts by making all customer engagements over last 13 years after have gained over 11 years of experience at tcs we are really happy to have you here hearty welcome to you sir it's proud moment to welcome our beloved chairman dr s n subramaniam sir and correspondent dr s rajalakshmi madam who have built this temple of learning with a great vision to serve the globe through committed strong technocrats and managers great welcome to the visionaries welcome you madam and sir next our welcome goes to the industry 4.0 person who is taking our institution to the next greater heights 
our young and dynamic technical director, Dr. Nalin Vimal Kumar sir, hearty welcome to you sir. I am really privileged to welcome Dr. V.P. Arunachalam sir, our director, SNS Technical Institutions, who is constantly guiding all of us in all spearheads. Welcome sir. The man who is not get tired for doing and leading from the front, our charmful principal, Dr. Chandur Pandian sir, who is about to present the annual day report to you. Welcome you sir. I, on behalf of SNS Institutions, welcome our CEO, Dr. M. Daniel, sir, and Principal SNS College of Engineering, Dr. Charles, sir, and Vice Principals of all our group of SNS Institutions for their gracious presence, support, and engagement in all our walks of life. Welcome to you all, dear leaders. Feeling happy to welcome our Administrative Officer, Mr. Marlathiram, sir, Dr. Vivekanandan, Vice Principal Academics, Mr. Mohan Narayanan, Operations Head, and all the Deans and Heads for this function. Our most cordial welcome to the present media members assembled here to cover the program. We acknowledge the wide coverage you have been giving for the years and supporting us. Welcome you all. In the end, I would like to welcome all the teachers, staff and teaching, non-teaching members and students who are an integral part of the institution. I request all your kind cooperation throughout this program and making it as a grand success. May this annual day be a momentous occasion filled with joy companionship and memories that will be cherished for the years to come. Let us embrace the celebration with open hearts, celebrating not just our accomplishments, but the spirit of togetherness that binds us as a community. Once again, a warm welcome to each and every one of you. Thank you for gracing us with your presence on this special day. Let the festivities begin. Thank you and good day to all. Thank you. Thank you, sir. An annual report is a measure to the past and window to the future. Without continuous growth and progress, words such as improvement, achievement, and success has no meaning. It is always a heartwarming experience to flip through the pages of our diary, reflecting on the paths we have traversed. Today, we, as we gather to reminisce and celebrate our achievements, I am honored to invite the resilient pillar of SNS College of Technology, our esteemed principal, Dr. S. Chendur Pandian, sir, to present the meticulously created annual report for the academic year 2023-24. A very good morning to all of you. Honorable Chief Guest of 22nd Annual Day, Sri GNV Subarao, Global Head Operation, IMNDS Process Automation Business, ABB Bangalore. Our Guest of Honor, Mr. Chandra Segaran, Assistant Director, Cognizant, Koyamutur, the most respected correspondent, Madam. Dr. S. Rajalakshmi, our esteemed chairman, SNS Group of Institutions, Dr. S. N. Subramanian, sir, our dynamic secretary come technical director, Dr. S. Nalin Vimal Kumar, dedicated director, Dr. V.P. Arunachalam, respected principal of SNS College of Engineering, Dr. Charles, vice principals, learned professors, faculty members of SNS College of Technology, administrative officers, dignitaries on and off the dash, present media, parents, and my dear students. We are extremely glad and redeemed it as a golden opportunity to have with us Sri GNV Subbarao from ABB Bangalore, a simple, successful, renowned, and eminent personality to grace this occasion. His passion to serve the society with the kind-hearted and dedication it is indeed a great pleasure and honor for me to welcome you, sir. I also welcome a man with rich experience, Dr. Mr. Chandra Sagar from CTS Koyamutur, on behalf of the management, principal, staff members, and the students of SNS College of Technology, Koyamutur. Also, I extend a warm welcome to one and all present here, and I take the great opportunity to present the annual report for the academic year 2023-24. Sri SNH Charitable Trust was established in the year of 1997 with the philanthropic outlook of serving the society in the fields of education, health and industry. Ever since the inception of Sri SNH Charitable Trust, we have been expanding it to a wide spectrum of educational stream from preschool to pre-advanced level 
graduate, postgraduate, and doctorate program in arts and science, education, management, engineering, pharmacy, allied health science, nursing, physiotherapy, and research center. The visionary and the exemplary architect of this trust is our beloved chairman, sir, Dr. S. N. Subramanian, who with more than four decades of rich experience is an enthusiastic person, a successful educationist, industrialist, a philanthropist, with a social reformer and a prominent personality who always stays close to our heart. Our chairman, sir, is supported by our correspondent, madam, who is well known and a distinguished doctor in the society. She is being highly respected and known for her kind heart and deeds with selfless social service for the society. We are all aware of her behaviors and experience which change the lives of many people in the society. It is really an honor to have our beloved correspondent, madam, for this annual day function. To effectively run this uh, trust and look after the day-to-day -day affairs of the 10 institutions under this trust, our native design thinker, secretary come technical director, Dr. S. Nalin Vimal Kumar. We all have dreams, but in order to make our dreams into a realistic one, it takes awful lot of determination, dedication, self-discipline, and effort. One such a person is our technical director, who guides us, guides the students, stop into the way of success by converting their dream into reality, by honing the skills and the student community with this efficient planning and flawless, flawless execution. Sir, you are a role model for all of us. It is your vision and leadership that has brought the innovative changes in our institution through design thinking. We are proud to announce that we are the first institution to implement a design thinking in our curriculum and the syllabus, and we won a pattern in design thinking. <clears throat> the institution run by Sri SNS Charitable Trusts are 10, namely Dr. SNS Rajalakshmi College of Arts and Science, established in 1999, SNS College of Technology in 2002, SNS College of Engineering, and SNS College of Education in 2007, SNS Academy in 2014, SNS College of Pharmacy and Health Science and Allied Health Sciences in 19, SNS College of Nursing and Physiotherapy and SNS B Spine in the year of 2020. Under the umbrella of SNS, Siri SNS Charitable Trust, these 10 institutions are run. Every institution has well defined vision, highly committed mission, and dedicated faculty members to deliver the excellence in design thinking based education and innovation through our five pillar team. SMS is ranked among the top five colleges in Koyamutur and we aspire to sign as one of the premier institutions in the country and become internationally recognized university worldwide. Coming to SNS College of Technology, which was established in the year of 2002, today the college offers 13 UG program and 4 PG program. In addition to this, we offer MBA and MCA courses. Totally, we have 19 courses. Five of our department, namely Mechanical, CAC, ECE, Triple E, and Civil, have been recognized as the research department by Anna University for doing research leading to PhD degree. Since the faculty members of the backbone of the institute, we have a bank of well-qualified, experienced, dedicated staff members. We have 234 teaching faculty, 107 non-teaching and ministerial staff members. The college is re accredited by NAC with the highest grade of A++. Five of our UG program, namely computer science, IT, ECE, Triple E and Mechanical are accredited by NBA under Washington Accord under Tier 1. Our primary concept is a design thinking where this approach is provide the students to have academic freedom to understand the complex problem and principles through engaged learning activities and help to nurture the progressive minds. 
the institutions works on the holistic five pillars for building entrepreneurial mindset and learning environment to learn collaborate and socialize the five pillars are clt cfc scd iipc sri which acts as the pillar of sns covering all the streams of life to strengthen our education system rather providing a traditional learning environment we focus on building culture focusing on delivery effective teaching learning innovation building skill entrepreneurial development industry concept and the social responsibilities i would like to announce few of the awards received by sns college of technology during the academic year 2023-24 sns city is ranked among 183 position in national level and 22nd position in tamil nadu private engineering college by the survey conducted by india today sns city secured 51 to 100 band in nar of innovation rank in career 360 india best engineering college ranking we have got and secured four year rating department of cac it triple e ece mechanical have been accredited by nba under tier 1 washington card 35 live mou have been signed during this academic year this academic year commenced in the odd semester and even semester for third fifth and seventh semester of pg and ug courses and even semesters are going on we are very happy to inform that our students are excellent and cooperating very well to maintain the discipline and the decorum in all aspects i thank our students for the discipline and the dress code behavior on this occasion <coughs> our management is very kind enough to build additional infrastructure facilities during this academic year by constructing building establishing new laboratories purchasing new equipment and the library books the central library called vivekananda library has been built with 1420 square meter with fully computerized barcode implemented and appreciated by all the experts during their visit the library is ex equipped with 68481 books with 1523 international journal 122 national journals and this year alone we have added worth of 8,72,700 worth books and additional journals to this library. Our students are performing very well in the end semester exams. In the end semester exam of November, December, the result was 86.64 percentage and in April, May 2023, the result is 90.23 percentage. The graduation rate of 23 passed out students, is, students are 98.23. The internal quality assurance cell has become the driving force for using the quality by working our intervention strategies to re remove the deficiencies and enhance the quality in education. Regular internal and external audits are conducted to ensure effectiveness in teaching learning process. The IQAC meetings are conducted once in a quarter with the external member to discuss the plan and activities of the college. Annual quality assurance report is regularly submitted to NAC. Coming to the design thinking framework, I am now to pro proud to present the unique features in SNS institutions, the design thinking framework. A curriculum structure based design thinking strategy that focuses on delivery of quality education by providing effective learning environment which supports built career skills, curiosity to learn more, leading to transform them as a true innovators who fix the real social, social needs and issues. The effectiveness of the DT framework implementation is done through five pillars and the students get identifying potential problem and solve them through the, through the seven emerging innovation technology and seven industry verticals. Eventually, they innovate, incubate, evolve their ideas into startup. The first pillar is CLT. The primary objective of CLT is to establish 
CLT by providing faculty with guidance and support to be an effective teacher and mentor. Area under the scope of CLT are recruiting, training, mentoring, appraisal, and rewarding. Totally 93 program including 49 seminars and workshop, 40 guest lectures, and four faculty development program were organized under the pillar of Center for Learning and Teaching. The next pillar is Center for Creativity. The CFC is rooted in the need of sustaining a culture of innovation on the campus. To achieve, the CF, to achieve this, CFC promotes inter-university and intra-university connects through foreign collaborations, student and staff exchange, and joint research activities. The research activities conducted by various departments in our institu institute are monitored by R&D cell periodically. This year, our faculty members and staff students have filed 259 patterns. Out of these 259 patterns, one is the product pattern, which is granted, 100 pattern published, and 81 are design pattern, patterns published. To add the, add the feather to R&D cell, this R&D cell has produced six PhD in this academic year alone through this five research center. Out of the six, two faculty, two are our faculties completed their PhD in this academic year. Faculty member of our college have published 100 quality research paper in reputed national and international journals, and also they have published 43 books. We have received grants worth of 5 crore 16, 16 lakhs 7,508 rupees for the academic year 2023-24 from various funding agencies. Rupees 15 lakhs of lakhs 91,000 grant has been received for fabrication and robotic arm for thermal application from AICT through RPS scheme. 68,748 rupees have been received on interfacing mechanical engineering with the AI and machine learning from IEI. 27 lakhs 94,970 rupees has been received from UGC grant from Parmars. 4 crore 94 lakhs rupees have been received for grant for chip to start up under the Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology, Government of India. Rupees 1 lakh grant has been received for 21 days summer winter school under DST scheme. 2, cro 2 lakhs rupees worth has been received for crown penetrating radar under ICFRE scheme. 2 lakhs 47,000 rupees has been received as a design thing idea than for comprehensive hazards under ISRO scheme. 30,000 rupees has been received from All India Seminar Applications on IoT Technology in the Management Association with IEI. We also do consultancy. This year alone, we have done the consultancy worth of 9,3902 rupees. The next pillar is SED, Skill and Career Development. These are the essential aspect for personal and professional growth. The students involved in these SED activities acquire new skills, improving the existing one, and advancing their career path. The placement cell assists the students in their pursuit, academic excellence, employability. This year alone, we have placed various students in various top-notch company with the highest salary package of 90 lakhs per annum. A total of 782 offers have been made with a placement record of 84.26 percentage. Coming to the next cell is IAPC, Industry Institute Partnership Cell in our college is functioning with the aim of bridging the gap between the industry and the institute. For better industry relationship, as on date, we have 205 live MOU with the industries and institute, out of which 305 MOUs have signed only in this academic year. A total 1,094 students completed their internship in industry and a total of 106 industrial visit to various industries located in Bangalore, Hyderabad, Cochin were arranged. The last 
pillar is social responsibility initiative since the establishment of sri snh charitable trust in the year of 1997 the society the trust serves in the various field of education through several educational institution the trust has been conducted various csr activities to uplift, uplift the society under the umbrella of snh social responsibility initiative various activities are conducted for elevating the quality life of community through outreach activities conducted by ncc nss oir and rrc like blood donation camp i camp awareness camp on heart disease rehabilitation and treatment national water awareness program polling awareness program road safety etc in addition to this our students visit the orphanage and they help the inmates with the material and the service whatever is required for them now the scholarships given to the students and other beneficiaries are we in, we help the students get the education loan scholarship from bank and government the management also provide scholarship called management scholarship with necessary arrangement for the needy students and we also help the students to get passport railway concession driving license etc serve the humanity is the service to the god that's what sr charitable trust believes and the trust provides quality service to the public through enhancement their basic educational medical and other day to day activities the management scholarship this year alone from snct 72 students have got benefited with worth of 32 lakhs 35000 rupees through government scholarship we have helped the students of 1320 students and they have received the fund of 3 crore 76 lakhs 42500 rupees central government scholarship 41 student got benefited out of which 10 lakhs rupees have been distributed the beneficiaries were public and family members of educational sns educational trust now i would like to highlight some of the notable achievement by our students our students have won many prizes in paper presentations and other events conducted in national level technical symposium at various engineering colleges our students have published 34 research papers in international journals and presented 82 papers in various national and international conference across the nation and presented 164 papers in symposiums some of the notable achievements by our students are selvi abhinaya sri of third year biomedical engineering secured first prize in poster presentation at nit trichy subhitra and harini of third year biomedical engineering has secured guinness world record for largest fence art of 400 4136 plastic cup at sns college of technology pragati is of third year biomedical engineering has secured nasa space application challenge local impact worth prize of 5000 has been won by him selvi puja of the second year biomedical engineering and niranjana and pravin of third year mca has created guinness world record for largest peacock rangoli santosh kumar kabilan of final year computer science have secured second prize for creating 100 user interface by figma tool in 5 hours and 40 minutes organized by youngster kalam world record in coimbatore <coughs> kavin hari of third year ece secured local award winner and problem solving under nasa space application challenge organized by jain deemed university bangalore devika smas of sumesh of food technology has secured first prize in miss golden face of south india at kochi hari prasant kugar kumar tanush kumar of final year mechanical have won the appreciation award and cash prize of 1000 rupees in india automation challenge event organized by ide mumbai hari prasad and nareesh kumar of final year mechanical got internship at iit karakpur 
with a stipend of 10,000 rupees through NPTEL. Team Signatory have won second and third year of Mechatronics, won the best aesthetic award in Tamil Nadu Karting Championship, Go Kart at Kwaimutur. Selvan Abhishek, final year mechanical, secured third prize in MR MRF third track, third track championship in round second in Kolapur. Abhinav and Muhammad Sabil of second year mechanical secured second prize in paper presentation at NIT Trichy. Jodi Pragas of MBA have created a record. Student Award is the one of the prestigious award in SNS group of institution, especially at the SNS College of Technology. Today we are going to witness POG Award by our technical director. Last year, Selvan Nagul Pranav, our final year CAC, was awarded the most prestigious, best outgoing all-rounder award and won the cash price of 15,000 rupees, a silver shield, rolling trophy with the merit certificate. It was presented during last year annual day function. The sports, our college is doing an excellent service and getting a lot of laurels for making the student physically beat by offering sports hour. Intramural sports also conducted every year. Many students have won their valuable contribution and prize. Mr. Karthian of final year CAC has won squash racket player represent Anna University at Swamia University, Mumbai. Ms. Megasiri of Karate player represented Anna University at the Southeast University, Madhya Pradesh. Our college students represent throwball Tamil Nadu, both men and women in national level at BR. We have brought winners in football men, ball bat pattern in women, runners in ball bat pattern, cricket, kabaddi, throw ball, koko, chess, we all become. The NSS is doing a wonderful job and our NSS have conducted anti-drug awareness camp and we have celebrated the lack cleaning event in association with Bhumi and Kaushika near Karangal. Our volunteers have participated in Vikshit Bharat at the 2047 campaign and the NSS have conducted seven day NSS special camp at Pondai Kaunar Pudur village for seven days and the theme is healthy youth and healthy India. And I am proud to inform to the chief guest and all the members, our NCC cadet are doing wonderful job and continuously past seven years they are taking part in the National Republic Day Parade and the cadet have attended various camps in addition to that various program also conducted. Some of the notable achievements by our NCC cadets are Corporal Tarun Aditya of Second Year AML has participated in Republic Day Parade camp at New Delhi and won silver medal and bronze medal for dance and song. Also she has, part she has participated in our cadet senior under officer Kishore of third year biomedical engineering and CEO, CEO Mona, Lisa, Mona Lisa of third year AML has participated in All India Chinese Camp at New Delhi and won silver medal in 10 pitching and silver medal for health and hygiene. Our cadet Aditya has become first cadet of SNS Tech to get shortlisted for youth exchange program at Bhutan country. Our cadet have secured 100% pass in both B certificate and C certificate exams. ORC and RRC also conducted various events like blood donation camp, tendal camp, tree plantation, blood sugar checkup, etc. Coming to my concluding remarks. Before I conclude the report, it is my duty to express my sincere thanks and gratitude to the management headed by our beloved managing trustee come correspondent, Rajalakshmi Madam. It is also my privilege 
to convey my thankfulness to our chairman Dr. Sam Subramanian sir SNS group of institution a mentor visionary and guide for the institution the native director, secretary and technical director Dr. S. Nalin Vimal Kumar for his constant encouragement and valuable guidance. I also take this opportunity to thank the governing council member, academic council member, board of studies, research policy board members, IQAC, IDMC for their contribution and active involvement in the development of our institution. My sincere thanks are due to Dr. VP Arunachalam, administrative officers and administrative officer and both the vice principal, Dr. Tamil Selvan and Dr. P. Vivekanandan for sharing their, sharing my burden in administration and academic area. I also thank all the faculty members, non teaching staff members, supporting staff, students, parents for having made this year 23-24 as an eventful year. Every year, academic, co-curricular, extracurricular performance of our college is always on the rise. We are proud to be the leader in producing outstanding graduates every year. My sincere appreciation goes to all the staff members and the students for their active involvement in bringing glory to this institution. My best wishes to all of you. Thank you. Jai Hind. Thank you, sir. Rest assured, we pledge to inscribe grander chapters into the tale of triumph for SNSCT, embellishing it with even more glorious victories and remarkable milestones. Simplicity is the glory of expression. Simplicity is the keynote all true elegance. True to the above quote, I now call upon Dr. L.M. Nithyama, Dean, Department of CSC, IG and AML, to introduce our Chief Guest Sri G.N.V. Subarao, sir. Respected luminaries on and off the dais, good morning everybody. Leaders become great not because of their power, but because of their power to empower people. I am delighted to introduce one such leader, our distinguished chief guest, Sri GNV Subarao. We are honored to have Mr. GNV Subarao, Global Head of Operation, IM&S, Process Automation Business Area, ABB Bengaluru, as the chief guest for this 22nd annual day function. Mr. GNV Subarao has acquired his formal degree in Electrical and Electronics Engineering from University of Vishweshwaraya College of Engineering, Bengaluru. And he has been a key participant in various international and domestic research forums and associations. Subarao is a versatile professional with a diverse range of roles and experience in technology development and business operations. He is an accomplished individual in the field of drives and automation. In a career spanning almost three decades with ABB, GNV has handled multiple roles including local business units and divisions in India. In these roles, he has handled units for various products. Later on, GNV moved into various global leadership roles which covered engineering, operations, research and development, manufacturing and distribution. Mr. GNV Subarav is currently the global head for quality operations industrial automation business area. In this capacity, he is the member of global leadership team for industrial automation, which is one of the four business areas. The leadership roles that GNV has handled includes the following, business unit head for industrial drives, India division head for industrial automation, which included business units addressing industries like metals, mining and cement, pulp and paper, oil and gas and chemicals, and product business covering industrial control and automation, instrumentation and analytics. Global Functional Head of Engineering for Industrial Automation Division and Head of Operation Center India. Managing Director of ABB Global Industries and Services Private Limited, a 100% holding company of ABB Zurich. Global Head of Process Control Platform, a unit handling a design, development, manufacture and support services for control and automation products of ABB. GNV has worked on various capacities and he has been instrumental in powering growth of driving drives business in the country. Under his leadership, ABB's drives business in India grew 10 times in few years and tripled the market share. During a stint of steering the engineering center for the automation division, productivity and engineering efficiency was enhanced by 20% in two years. Our cheapest years of focus and dedication to develop the GCC for ABB group has immensely made a difference to the long-term operational sustainability at ABB. Due to his committed service, 
Analytics India magazine has featured our chief guest in their top global capability center head in India 2023, which is a highly honored recognition for our chief guest. This recognition is a testimony to his remarkable leadership and innovation in the industry. Our chief guest goes by the saying, work hard in silence, let your success be your noise. We are very much fortunate to have such a great personality amidst us today. Sir, your presence will definitely influence our young student minds to a greater level. Thanks for the opportunity. Good day. Thank you, ma'am. The memory of the magnificent monuments and appreciation, a word of gratitude may indelibly etch its presence in our minds. Here we come with a small endowment to greet our today's chief guest. I request our chairman, Dr. S. N. Subramanian, sir, to honor the chief guest, Sri G. N. V. Subbarao, sir, with a shawl and a memento. Thank you, sir. Speakers who talk about what life has taught never fail to keep the attention of their listeners. We are indeed blessed to have a wonderful personality amongst us and we are very eager to listen to your words. And now we may call upon our honorable chief guest of the day, Sri G. N. V. Subarav, sir, Global Head of Operations, IMNS Process Automation, Business Area, ABB Bengaluru, to address the gathering. Still morning. Good morning, everyone. Uh, thank you for the nice introduction. I'm really humbled by the good words that uh, you had to say about me. I'm honored to be here amongst all of you. I'm very thankful to uh, Chairman Sir, the Correspondent Madam, uh, and uh, the Principal, and all the other members of the management of this uh, institute. It feels very, very nice to be here uh, in this event. I'm also very excited to be spending time uh, on this day where you're celebrating a lot of things. You're celebrating success, you're celebrating continuity, you're celebrating uh, evolution, you're celebrating innovation, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And uh, it's a fantastic opportunity to be among all of you when you're celebrating so many things and uh, uh, re really excited to be here. Every time there is an opportunity to get into an occasion like this where I meet young minds, where I meet, uh, get to participate with the uh, visionaries who have done uh, everything that they have passion for, I, I seize the opportunity. I seize this opportunity for two things. One is impart what I have gained over 30, 35 years. Uh, in my career, but also a large part of my life with, uh, with all of you. But I'm also a little bit selfish, so I also want to learn. And every time I come into such an occasion, spend time with uh, you know, the, 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 the experienced, esteemed people, but also the young minds, at the end of the day, I find that I've learned a lot. I can't decide whether I've learned a, a more or you know, given you uh, back more. I, that's a tough decision to make, but it's, it's a fantastic uh, opportunity to share my experiences, at the same time learn from your experiences, your thought process, etc., etc. So I'm hoping that uh, when, when I accepted this, I was hoping that this would be another such occasion. But when I come in here, interact with all of you, I'm convinced that is going to be one of those momentous days where uh, uh, I learn a lot and at, at the same time I'm able to impart certain, uh, uh, certain experiences, certain uh, learnings to all of you. And I'm hoping that this will also lead to a, to a sort of uh, continuous uh, relationship. I, I mean, any, any relations or most relations should be fruitful and to be fruitful, they need to be a little bit short and uh, medium term at least, if not long term. I'm really hoping that this would, these relations would also be so. When I look around, when I talk to the, the professors, when I talk to some of the students, 
when I, when I listen to the infrastructure that you have created, but also when I hear about the achievements, which was read out, and I read a few things also on the annual report, I'm pretty much convinced that uh, not just India, but the world is in safe hands for the future. You are the people who would shape the world in the future through your innovations, through your thoughts, and also through your technical skills. And remember, it's not just technical skills, it is skills that would build the future in general, not just on the technical side. Now, why do I say this? Why is it so important to talk about the future? Why is it so important to talk about how safe it is? You all know that it's, it's, it's an evolving world. There are a lot of things that are happening. And uh, I, I'm not too sure whether to call it evolving, an evolution, or a revolution. Things change so fast. In our years, when we were young, things did change. But probably I'm seeing the changes happening maybe 10 times faster than what it used to happen, let's say, 30 years back. I, I, I was talking to uh, the chairman, sir, and uh, all of the others, and I got the same view that the changes that are happening now, it's a very dynamic world. So that convinces me that we need to be preparing ourselves and preparing the world to face these new challenges which come through changes and these challenges are not bad. Most of them turn out to be very good for the world when the challenges are overcome and we have solutions for it. I always believe that when I look at the generations that followed our generations, we have various names, generation X, Z, Y, the amount of progress that you people have given to the world is, is much, much more, it's much more magnified than we could ever do in our generations. So that is another point which is very visible and which makes people like us believe that the, the more we empower you, the more we empower uh, you people to, to create things, to use your technical skills, to use your other skills, but also your imagination, the better the world is going to be. So that's a firm conviction that we, some of us carry. And that's the reason why uh, I, I feel that exchange of thoughts, exchange of ideas is very important. I was listening very keenly to the speakers earlier and a lot of, uh, I would say, uh, concepts which were turned into phrases came out. A few of them I quote. One of them was uh, talking about uh, continual learning. Then I also heard the word resilience. I was talking to people here, I, I came across the phrase passion. And when, when you think about all these things, they are all interwoven. And they, they need to be sort of thought through to understand what actually it means and how does it, how does it pan out in our, in our lives? How does it pan out in our careers? What do we need to do? And if you pick up on this, uh, phrase on the concept of continual learning, which I think is a nice subject to talk about, given the fact that you need to be continuously updated, you need to be continuously learning, because the world is forcing you to. And uh, we all need to learn, create at a much faster rate for, uh, for, for the world to be in a far better place. Uh, it's, it's good to understand what, what it takes what it takes to be continuously learning. When I go back 30 years, 35 years, if I had to take a step, which is a change from what I was doing, or something which I had to do something you know, new, it always used to be a lot of self-doubts. It always used to be questioning whether I can do it or not. Have you guys also undergone such things? Can you raise your hands, the people who have had to face certain things, maybe an exam, maybe an uh, entrance exam, maybe a decision on your career, and then you were petrified. 
you were afraid, you were having a lot of self-doubts. How many of you went through this? At least I have gone through it. Can you raise your hands? Good. How many of you have been able to overcome these fears? And then face the challenge, overcome the challenge and do good to yourself. I raise my hand. How many more? Good. So all of us go through this. All of us go through this, you know, phase where we have a lot of doubts. We question ourselves, which is good. But the important thing is to gather courage, face the problem and overcome it. And this is probably called resilience. You know, doing this more and more, overcoming these self-doubts, proving to yourself that you are good, is called resilience, as for me. Now, this becomes a very important part in this uh, world where you need continual learning. There's another aspect which I think is the very uh, basis of doing well in a fast-paced, dynamic world, and that, I guess, is passion. When I look around, when I look on the stage, I see very good examples of passion. I was talking to the chairman, sir, where he explained about himself, first generation uh, graduates, first generation entrepreneurs, and uh, all the educational uh, uh, qualifications that you have, and also the correspondent, Ma madam, uh, you, you have been a doctor, but then following your passion, you have done so many things which are different. So this, I guess, is the foundation for doing things and maybe doing things which are not entirely what you intended to do, but then you learned as you progressed. You learned as you walked the life and then said that, look, I have to do something different, I have to do something bigger, and uh, you follow your passion. So passion is very important. And when you are in this uh, mode of passion, there is another thing which comes into uh, you know, into being naturally, and that is awareness. Awareness of yourself and awareness of your surrounding. So when you pursue something passion, uh, your, your passion, when you, when you are passionate about things around you, a natural result of that is awareness. And that is a very important thing. Without awareness, most things are not possible. If you are not aware of what's happening, what are the changes that are happening? If you're not aware of what your strength is and what you possibly don't want to do, then dealing with the challenges that the world for, you know, uh, poses is quite difficult. So awareness is very important. So keep yourself, I would say, I keep myself updated as much as possible. I find 10, 15 minutes, I try to read something. And uh, I, I would advise all of you to also do that. Awareness is very important. It comes, it's everywhere. You just have to seek out the information that you want. And, uh, uh, you know, it's at your fingertips. And then you can learn from it. So when you have passion, you create awareness. And then on top of it, you get into the mode where every day is, is a learning, a day for learning. Every experience is a learning experience. And this probably is called continual or continuous learning. So it is not necessary that uh, it has to be a formal classroom sort of learning that you have to do. So many, many people tell me that, look, we would like to be students, maybe for 25 years, and then we need to get into the field and, uh, uh, you know, start implementing what we have learned. And when we discuss, there's always a self-doubt whether Learning is possible when you're trying to implement it. Will you not be swamped by the demands of the job, demands of your family, et cetera, et cetera? Where do you have time for learning? But I'm, I'm pretty sure, through my experience at least, that uh, if you are passionate, if you are aware of what you have to learn and where you can get this information from, where this learning can come from, it's quite easy to be on an everyday learning mode. It could be half an hour, it could be one hour, it could be two hours during the weekend, but it happens. So, my advice to a lot of people who seek, uh, who seek to know how to be on the continuous learning path is to say, look, develop a passion, passion for learning, 
it could be passion about certain subjects but generally there should be a passion then you try and understand what the world is doing how how the world in what direction it is progressing and how you could play a role there place yourself in the evolving or the you know the the dynamic world and see how you can you can play a role there and everything else will flow naturally am i am i speaking theory am i speaking uh, you know something which is nice to read and talk but tough to practice i don't think so when i look around all of us i mean i spoke about what has been done by uh, you know some of the esteemed people sitting on the stage what i do myself in 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 this instrument which is originally called a phone there are nothing less than 500 books and a lot of you know newsletters a lot of podcasts i carry this always with me so that by 10 minutes or half an hour that i have i can i can make use of this this is how this is the opportunity that you get this is the opportunity that the new technologies have given to us and i think we have to embrace this we really have to embrace this change we really have to focus and decide that look i am going to do my best on the continuous learning uh, program there are enough and more opportunities there are enough and more information that could help me there and even a small interaction with a person who knows things could be a knowledge gatherer for you 10 or 15 minutes that you spend with a person you get strike the right conversation you 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 leave that conversation being a little more wiser than what you were half an hour back i think if you get into that mode if each one of us gets into that mode i'm not saying i'm perfect but i can tell you i have practiced this and i am quite satisfied with the progress that i have made i'm sure there are many people who have done this better they have better methods they have better dedication but at least i'm convinced that to whatever degree that you would want to do it it is possible to live in this world survive thrive not just survive but also thrive and who else can do it but you guys you people who are young who have a solid foundation of learning of structured thinking and this is a structured thinking method once cultivated forms the basis of everything that you can learn and implement in the future so when i listen to all the accolades that you have had all the achievements that i have had i'm convinced that most of you generally have built up that foundation required to put you on to a path of continuous learning and it's up to you now to find those methods to find your passion you to find the set of passions maybe and then say that look this is the path that i take till the time i am satisfied with that and maybe later i find something else do you do you all resonate with this idea do you think it is it is possible do you think it is possible that every day you end up being a little bit wiser a little bit more informed than what you were yesterday is that a possibility do you all think that your learning process does not end after your graduation or post graduation but will be a lifelong journey uh, for whatsoever uh, Uh, you know number of years that you have do you really believe in it any any hands raised at least i believe in it i don't know about you you guys but for the, all the non believers i would tell you take this as an assurance from me take this as a uh, assurance coming out of practice the self practice it is possible it is possible now you might ask why should i do this why should i learn this i can tell you in the world that is changing so much if we don't continuously update us i think the chances of us becoming irrelevant is very high and that irrelevance path can be very short i mean if you all assume that i have uh, finished my learning process and i'm safe for the next 30 years i think we really have to if I, sorry if i'm sounding negative we have to remove that from our mind and convince ourselves that we have to update ourselves continuously we have to be really continuously learning and be and you have to assure yourself that there are plenty of opportunities and you will find the right one you really will find the right way of learning continuously you will find the right way of surviving and doing well uh, for for many many years and decades of your life uh, 
um, and, and, and probably be, you know, feeling very proud of yourself. Any, any thoughts on this? I don't know whether it's possible to communicate, but uh, if I can ask you a few questions, does it make sense? Whatever I told you, does it make sense? If you can sort of respond by raising your arms, I mean raising your hands, does it make sense? Do you really feel that it is necessary? It is necessary to go on to the path of continuous learning. I need more answers because I have to go back knowing that uh, what I think is right. But uh, at least maybe I go back saying that, look, maybe I'm not right. I need to update myself. So what do you say? Yes or no? First say yes. Or if you're saying no, please let me know if it's a no. Okay, so, so I, I guess you're all convinced as to the need of continual, uh, you know, sort of learning. Another question, the last question that I would ask you, how much of you have this passion to go along this path? Please, please raise your hands. Do you have the passion? Do you think you need to do it? Good, I think a large majority of you people feel very strongly for this, especially the passion part and that is enough to put you on the right track. Uh, and, and I'm sure as we go along, we will uh, uh, meet each other in various forums, various methods, and maybe we can test each other as to whether we are still learning. And uh, 10 years hence, when I'm a little bit old, older, when I'm a little bit, uh, you know, uh, uh, not so much updated on technologies, on the latest technologies, maybe I'll come to you to learn it from you. And, uh, and, and, and still survive in this world. So thanks for giving this opportunity to me for talking in front of you. In the afternoon, I'm hoping to see your labs and see what more is possible. And as I said, uh, uh, when, when, uh, when I was requested to come here, I did have a few visitors, so I was saying no, but then I never, I never, uh, you know, lose an opportunity to take part in this opportunity. I reshuffled it and made a point to be here. So thanks for this opportunity. And uh, I I'm sure what I shared with you would help you along your path. Uh, and and uh, what I'm going to take, you know, take away from this meeting, now the interaction, but maybe in the afternoon, some more interactions, that is also going to help me a lot. With this, thank you so much and do well. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Success isn't always about greatness. It's about consistency. One such consistent, hardworking personality is Dr. M. Manjula Devi, ma'am, professor and head of department of chemistry. I now request her to introduce our guest. She is Chandra Segrin, sir. A very pleasant morning to one and all present here. It gives me a great pleasure to introduce our guest of honor for our annual day celebration. We are honored to have with us Mr. S. Chandra Sehrani, an Associate Director at Cognizant, specializing in testing services. He holds a B.Tech in Electronics and Communication Engineering from Pondicherry Engineering College. With a remarkable career spanning, 24 years of experience in the IT industry, he brings a wealth of experience and expertise to our event today. Beginning his journey with 11 years at Tata Consultancy Services, followed by 13 years at Cognizant Technology Solution Corporation. His leadership in managing insurance customers in the US, Netherlands, and UK, coupled with his experience in various technologies and international assignments, reflects his incredible versatility and dedication. Certified in .NET, PMP, Project Management Professional, ISTQB, International Software Testing Qualification Board, and INS21. His commitment to excellence is evident in his passion for training and team building. Beyond his professional accomplishment, he is also passionate, enthusiast of diverse interests, including career guidance, farming, Tamil literature, bonsai, and hiking. As we gather here today to celebrate our achievements and milestones, let us extend a warm welcome to our guest of honor, Mr. S. Chandrasegrane, whose presence adds immense value and inspiration to our annual day celebration 2024. 
வெற்றிகள் என்றும் நம்பசமே வெற்றியாளர்களும் நம்பசமே தேங்க்யூ சார் தேங்க்யூ மேம் கிராட்டிடியூட் அன்லாக்ஸ் தி ஃபுல்னஸ் ஆஃப் லைஃப் இட் டர்ன்ஸ் வாட் வி ஹேவ் இன்டு எனஃப் அண்ட் மோர் and i request our technical director dr s nalan vimal kumar sir to present our guest of honor shri s chandrasekharan sir with a shawl and memento as an expression of gratitude and in explicable bond we have arranged with him thank you sir Confidence is the most important single factor in this game and no matter how great your natural talent there is only one way to obtain and sustain it we are in that to call upon our distinguished guest of honor shri s chandrasekharan sir associate director cognizant coimbatore to felicitate the gathering thank you very much thank you everyone for this time and opportunity um so i'm going to take only 5 or 10 minutes of your time i i know we are over the schedule um, and i'm going to touch upon what uh, um our subhrav sir told earlier um he gave a very good formula he told uh, continuous learning plus resilience plus acceptance plus passion that's going to give you success can you relate anyone who has done that success how many of you are csk fans wow how many of you know mahendra singh dhoni <laughs> does he have these qualities he is resilient right he learns continuously he accepts what he gets whichever position you give him he will play right so without continuous learning without resilience without acceptance and most importantly without patience he wouldn't have come to this place that's that's the formula that he was giving okay um so thank you for that i'm just extending on what he was saying um my my second part my first part is over my second part um tamil ellarku inga theriyum nu nenikiren na vandu thiruvallur oda help eduthuk poran enga company la yaar vandu eduthupaanga endradhukku oru oru chinna example திருவள்ளூர் வந்து மேனேஜ்மெண்ட் பிரின்சிபல்ல வந்து ஒரு ரெண்டே வரியில சொல்லிட்டு போயிட்டாரு எதனை எவனால் யார் முடிப்பன் என அறிந்து அதனை அவன் கண் விடல் இதை வச்சு நம்ம ஒரு ஒரு புக்கே எழுதலாம் உங்களுக்கு வந்து இது தேவை வந்து ரெண்டே வேர்டு தான் எவன் முடிப்பன் த ஒன் ஹூ இஸ் ஏபிள் டு கம்ப்ளீட் த டாஸ்க் தட் இஸ் கிவன் டு ஹிம் இரஸ்பெக்டிவ் ஆஃப் எனி சேலஞ்ச் இரஸ்பெக்டிவ் ஆஃப் எனி அப்ஸ்டக்கல் ஆர் எனி என்வரான்மெண்ட் தட் இஸ் பிளேஸ்ட் இன் ஹி ஷுட் பி ஏபிள் டு கெட் இட் டன் ஸோ அந்த எவன் முடிப்பண்ணா நீங்கள் இருந்தீங்கன்னா காக்னிசன் உங்களை டெஃபினட்டாக எடுத்துப்பாங்க ஓகே இவ்வளோதான் எனி கொஸ்டின்ஸ் ஏதாவது பேசணுமா இன்னும் அன்ஃபார்ச்சுனேட் தே டோன்ட் ஹேவ் அ மைக் டு ஹாவ் எனி கொஸ்டின்ஸ் பட் இவ்வளோதான் ரெண்டே ஃபார்முலா தான் அவர் சொன்ன ஃபார்முலா யூ வில் பிகம் லைக் மகேந்திர சிங் தோனி நான் சொன்ன ஃபார்முலா யூ கேன் get into cognizant or any it it company that you, that places you liya um i i heard from um, uh, your your secretary that there are a lot of lot of opportunities given and there are there are forums that the five he explained about the five pillars so on, on the five pillars la vandu change management indra the one big concept in company cognizant or beat any other company they will be looking for people who are very innovative creative and uh, take things forward adlo vand most important thing vand people will come up with ideas people will have a lot of information knowledge and all that but one who is able to take it to completion that that is that is what is needed in any person um or or job interview ku poringa na ungala or question kepanga which project did you did what was your final year project give me some examples of paper that you presented give me some examples of uh, um the paper presentations you made any um institutions that you have gone for uh, institutional training and all that avan kekra question goda answer enna na ninga edhaadu mudichirkingala urupadiya appadina avladha if you are able to complete something company will find you fit for their use okay so i'll leave you with that thought um i'll save a lot of time for you the time nobody in no other vision are so if if you are 
another formula. So if you have 24 hours a day, spend it 50% on your body, 40% on your mind and 10% on your soul. Take care 50% of the time for your body, 40% for learning new things, improving yourself and 10% for your soul. Soul edukana, you do meditation so that whenever you feel stressful or when some challenge comes or when you fail, you should be able to jump back. Learning 40% yanana, unless you have that continuous learning put in place, you will not go anywhere. You will be stuck and stagnant. And the 50% body, unless you have a body, you will not be able to move forward anywhere. You will be sitting stagnant in, in the same place. In company, people will have a lot of knowledge, but uh, they will have knee pain, back pain, head pain, all sorts of problems. They will not be able to deliver something. So, so there are three formulas. It's up to you to pick and choose what you want and take it from there. Th thank you very much for the opportunity. Okay. Thank you, sir. Recognition is the honor paid to a person for his efforts taken to, to achieve something. SNSCT has never failed to recognize even a single small effort taken by any of the staff or students in any field. This is the movement of recognition, the innumerable achievers of SNSCT in various departments. Now, let's get rolling. An epitome on the quest for delicacy who reached the pinnacle of human intellect. And for this, may I now call upon Dr. S. Sundar Rajan, sir, Head of Department MCA, to enlist the PhD awardees. Good morning to the dignitaries present in uh, and on the dais. So to honor the PhD awards, I call Dr. G. L. Karthik from Biomedical Engineering. from Computer Science and Engineering. Congratulations, Professor. Now, first rank holders, the stage is waiting for you. And for the first time, I wish I too was a first ranker. And now I call upon Dr. NGR Muniraj, sir, Dean Department EC, to enlist the first rank holders. Dear delegates, it's my honor and great privilege to welcome the first rank holders, Kavya Shri G of First Year Arrow, Ashwin M of Final Year Agri. Priyadarshini M of third year Agri. Srimadi S.S. Yes of second year Agri. Kavya K of first year Agri. Shamkaran of first year Agri. Veera Sami R of third year Auto. Sanjay Kumar M of second year Auto. Nitish Kumar T of first year Auto. 
Soundarya, yes, of final year food technology. Shanmuga Darshini, or of second year food technology. Babadarini GS of first year food technology. Anusha Anthony A of final year BME. Tarun S of second year BME. Udaya Swati, yes, of first year BME. Adaikalam of second year PG Civil. Maria Tina, A of final year Civil. Saravana Priya M of third year Civil. Gopi Krishnan J of second year civil. Dharani Sri K of first year civil. Rajalakshmi R of second year CSC PG. Gunavati KR of first year CSC PG. Kalaiwani M of final year CSC. Vishnupriya MK of third year CSC. Harishruti JK of second year CSC. Supriya S of first year CSC. Soundarya S of final year Tripoli. Sri Varshini R of third year Tripoli. Mahamala S of first year Tripoli. Kritika R of final year ECE. M of third year ECE. Praveena J of second year ECE. Sabarita JS of first year ECE. Kiruba G of final year IT. Anku Aishwarya S of third year IT. Anusraj CR of second year IT. Kavya ST of first year IT. Fatima Nasreen B of third year AIML. Kumuta Kumar of second year AIML.
Shanmukapriya, C of first year AML. Rajesh V of second year Dermal. Nilesh K of final year Mechanical. Gokul Nath V of third year Mechanical. Ariharan S of second year Mechanical. Ariharan B of first year Mechanical. Susender C of final year MCT. Hari Prasad V of third year MCT. Gokul P of second year MCT. Muhammad Suhail, MA of first year MCT. Reshma K of second year MBA. Bala Mageshwari M of second year MBA. Sveta Devi R of first year MBA. Satya Lakshmi PV of second year MCA. Kartika B of first year MCA. Sakti S of first year MBA B spine. Subhashri G of first year MBA B spine. Thank you and my best wishes. Congratulations everyone. Now it's time to honor the faculty members for the grants and consultancies received. For this I now call upon Dr. B. Sridhar Sir, Dean Agri and Food Technology. Good morning to Ronaldal present on the dais, on the of the dais. It's my pleasure to welcome the faculty members who had received the research grant for the upliftment of SNS College of Technology. First, let me invite our dynamic and beloved Dr. NJR Muniraj, Dean ECE, for the project, the design and development of ground penetrating radar with on-field reconfiguration capability applicable to sustainable industrial and agricultural purpose, chip to start uh, category one, Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology, to a tune of 4 crore 94 lakhs rupees. Next, uh, I am happy to invite the highly responsible and cheerful Dr. Yellam Nithya Madam, Dean CSE and uh, IT, and Dr. R. Rajeshagaran, IKC coordinator for the project, the one promised from UGC to a team of 27 lakhs 94,917. 94, I invite our most respected and beloved principal sir, Dr. S. Shendur Pandian and Dr. C. Ramakrishnan, Professor and Head, Tripoli Department for the Modernization of Power System Laboratory from AACTE to a twin of rupees 18,6667. I am 
happy to invite our beloved professor dr c gajendran professor civil to receive the project titles studies on root architecture of eucalyptus clones using ground penetrating radar design thinking ideation for comprehensive hazard resilience and summer school in geospatial science and technology to a team of around 2 lakh 4 lakh 50000 rupees Next, I am happily invite most dynamic and cheerful Dr. B. Tamil Shivam, Vice Principal Administration and Dean Mechanical, and Dr. C. Soumya Dhanlakshmi, HOD Mechanical, for the projects on design and fabrication of robotic arm for thermal applications obtained from funding agency of AACG to a tune of rupees fifteen lakhs ninety one thousand seven hundred and sixty six. Next, another grant proposal, which was won by again our VP Administration and Dean Mechanical, Dr. P. Tamil Chandram Sir, and coordination with Dr. C. Chandil Kumar, ASP Mechanical. for the interfacing mechanical engineering with artificial intelligence and machine learning from institute of engineers to a team of rupees 50000 next time happily inviting young dynamic assistant professors from us from the department of agricultural engineering and department of food technology for securing the grant for conducting all india seminar on application of iot technologies in smart water management in association with institute of engineers to a tune of rupees 50 30000 and the last not the least the faculty members who had received the consultancy fund that is none other than our dedicated academician and vice principal academics dr p vivekanandan hod megatronics along with dr t prakash hod academics megatronics dr n karthi ap megatronics then mr michael jones ap megatronics for the projects automate the whole unit with reasonable charges and the industry benefited out of this project is selby tech e road to a given of grant received rupees 184902 thank you congratulations everyone now it's time to honor the faculty members for the patents granted mr m ramesh assistant professor agree Dr V Uma assistant professor agree Ms R Muttuminnal assistant professor agree Ms R Mohana Priya assistant professor agree Dr R Karthik HOD BME Mr S Prince Samuel Assistant Professor BME Mrs J Jerina Begum Assistant Professor BME Dr K Tirumalai Raja Professor Civil Dr O R Kavita ASP Civil Dr R M Karthikeyan Assistant Professor Civil Mrs P Shubashri Assistant Professor CSC Dr K Sangeeta Professor and HOD CSC Mrs Sri Narmada a, a, assistant professor CSC Ms Vijay Lakshmi assistant professor CSC Dr S Angel Lata Meri HOD IG and AML Dr S Muttu Vijay Pandian
senior innovator I have. Mrs. C. Ramya, assistant professor, Tripoli. Dr. J. Geeta Ramani, HOD, EC. Dr. S. Angel Lata Mary, HOD, IG and AML. Mrs. C. Ramya, assistant professor, Tripoli. Dr. L. M. Nitya, Dean CSC IG AML. Dr. T. Prakash, Professor Cumhead, MCT. Mr. Michael Jones M, Assistant Professor, MCT. Mr. Balaji P, Assistant Professor, MCT. Mr. Karthik N, Assistant Professor, MCT. Ms. Swati J, Assistant Professor, MCT. Dr. K. Kanagamani, Associate Professor, Chemistry. Dr. S. R. Kalevani, As Assistant Professor, Chemistry. Dr. T. Arun Kumar, Assistant Professor, Chemistry. Dr. M. Manjula Devi, Professor and Head Chemistry. Ms. M. Narmada, Assistant Professor, Chemistry. Ms. V. Sandhya, Assistant Professor, Max. Mr. S. Raja, Assistant Professor, EC. Assistant Professor Physics. Dr. V. Manigandan, Assistant Professor Physics. Mr. M. Sriram, Assistant Professor Physics. Ms. D. Sunanda, Assistant Professor Max. Dr. G. Nandini, Assistant Professor Max. Mr. P. M. Chellabandi, Assistant Professor Max. Ms. S. Sinduja, Assistant Professor Max. Ms. K. Shrutika, Assistant Professor MBA. NCC, YRC and Best Library Users, Anjuka Bharati T of CSC, Devika S of Agri, Tanushri TA of EC, MJ of CSE, Surya Deja Kamma of ECE, Dino Joel PJ of MCT, Jagadishwaran P of Mechanical. Kishore B.D. 3rd year BME, Aditya M. 3rd year Aerospace. Best RRC Volunteers, L.R. Darnish, Final Year ECE, S. Vishnu Prasad, 3rd year ECE, 
M. Kishor Kumar, third year ECE, L. M. Pavitran, third year CSE, M. C. Nitya Sri, third year CSE. Best YRC volunteers. Burnation, third year ECE, Gunavi, third year ECE, Kirtana M, third year ECE, Vignesh Kumar R, third year food technology, Kritika R, final year ECE, Santosh Kumar Kabilan S, final year CSE. Best Library User Faculty, Kavi Priya S, Assistant Professor, ECE. Best Library User Student, Hari Prashant R of Final Year MCT. Folks, the gallons of surprise that cannot be more withheld are spilling in 3, 2 and 1 and here we go. The nominees for the Best Outgoing Student and Five Pillar Achiever Awards. So I now invite our dearest technical director, Dr. S. Nalil Vimal Kumar, sir, to enlist the best outgoing student and five pillar achiever award nominees. In the Nal Vandi Rumba Serapana Nala Amayarke, Chief Guest and Guest of Honor, and our beloved Chairman and Correspondent, Madam, along with your parents and beautifully dressed up faculty members. <coughs> Thanks a lot to all of them uh, for making it today. For making it today, I will uh, in the ARP, BOG, and pillar-wise nominees uh, and the selection process. I learned a lot from my students. From my students, I have learned a lot. In the process, one of the things which struck me out is. Over student apa ti na terangkan kerana ada, unggal apa ti unggal orang friends solat tu apa ni inte, ur exercise bacaan ni, anda exercise la particular a ur face la negativity about your peer members, mata unggal apa ti ana kurai gal solingnya apa ni inte solir ni, apo the first thing everybody shocked. Me and also, uh, I'm so happy the way they expressed their constructive criticism. Eppadi matta vangloda manasu punbada ame, avangloda ya valarchi kaha. Ninge matta vangla pati karthikal sona the vande. It is very very uh, inspiring. It is very stunning, and I really feel that SNS has a DNA not to hurt others but to give a great constructive criticism. For that, a great applause for every one of you. Idhila vande one of the student na negative pati solenge solenge soli trande bode. Thank you, sir. Number negative pati paisa venta sir. Negative number suti nereya irik already. 
அதனால நம்ம பாசிட்டிவ் பத்தி நம்ம பேசுவோம் அப்படின்ட்டு போல்டா ஒரு பொண்ணு சொல்லுச்சு சோ that that actually takes courage and boldness because we are filled with negativity and pessimism but looking at the positivity is something that is that belongs to great minds and that belongs to sns minds my dear lovable students so uh, for this process my uh, arp and bog and dt team had put lot of efforts not only that எல்லாருமே உங்களுடைய பேரண்ட்ஸில் இருந்து எல்லாருமே நிறைய எஃபர்ட்ஸ் எடுத்திருப்பாங்க அதுக்கு முன்னாடி ரொம்ப நேரமாக காற்று விசிறிட்டு இருக்கீங்க ஸோ ஒரு சின்ன ஒரு சேலஞ்ச் எப்பவும் போல் நான் வைக்கிறேன் லெட் அ சி ஹூ ஆக்சுவலி வென்ஸ் எல்லாத்துக்கும் விசில் அடிக்க தெரியுமாப்பா பிளீஸ் <laughs> யாரெல்லாம் நாமினேட் ஆயிருக்காங்க அப்படின்ட்டு ஒரு சின்ன ஒரு ட்ரெய்லரும் டீசரையும் பார்த்துடலாம் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் வீ ஸ்டார்ட் வித் ஃபைவ் பில்லர் பேஸ்ட் டீசர் அண்ட் ட்ரெய்லர் ஆடியோ வந்ததுன்னா பரவாயில்லப்பா nominees or more than that but i like to congratulate the five pillars nominees and also the winners are for clc and all the pillars we have five finalists and i welcome all the five members onto the stage to receive all the five pillar awards please congratulations to all the five members clt award goes to computer science department kalaiwani scd award goes to civil department maria tina cfc award goes to csc department kartikey IPC award goes to EC department Surya 
and the SRA award goes to CSE department Darshan. CT. So, congratulations to all the members. Kunch volume, kunch kong hai. BGM volume. 
we have uh, decided to break the entire award into three classifications. One is best outgoing student and the next one is leaders of today and the last one is leaders of tomorrow of the inter mood classification we have actually split and uh, we will start with the last one like it is like gold, silver and then bronze Mari in the moon award we will actually release it for BOG and uh, there are not just one member there are multiple members and we decide to release the leaders of tomorrow first okay. the winners of leaders of tomorrow are CSE department Sani you can step forward and then please wait I request all the chief guests to uh, honor the winner all together CSE department Suraj Agri department Ashwin CSE department Dinesh Agri department Devika Biomedical Sivaranjani Computer Science Harsha Vardini IT Department Kriba Civil Department Sapna Biomedical Anusha All the 11 members belong to leaders of tomorrow award and hearty congratulations I invite the dignitaries to Recognize them and then share a group picture. The other members, please stay on stage. and then closest one of my heart, Hari from Agri, I had actually missed uh, as leader of tomorrow, my excuse is Hari. And now we will announce the leaders of today. The leaders of today, Abdina, BOG Vandur, Patta Award Rinchna, Elatakum Kuduka Kudi Alak, they have actually performed. So, uh, the leaders of today are, belongs to Biomedical Department, Mechatronics Department, Food Technology, Mechatronics, Biomedical, Biomedical, Mechanical, ECE, CSE, Agri. So Priya Darshani, 
of Biomedical, Hari Prashant, Kiba, Sanjay, Gomadi, Somnath, Vishwa, Danush, Vinod, Ilan Talir. Huh? Parents of the winners can actually join the stage if they wish to. That leaves us to only one person left who is Kirtika, who is going to be the winner of Best Outgoing Student Award. She is from ECE department. Kirtika would like to call Dean HOD parents and Uday Kumar sir on to the stage. Vijay Kumar. forget that. On behalf of the entire SNS uh, group, for the work that they have been actually doing together, I wouldn't classify them as like BOG or leaders of today or tomorrow. Entire group, we would like to recognize them with a cash award of like 1 lakh rupees. I will let them to use it the way that you guys prefer to use it for the good cause or whatever that will help you to uplift your life forward, okay? Who wanted to actually come forward to collect? from the all the winners 
if you guys like to share a few words, please do not hesitate to take up the mic. First of all, I would like to thank the management, Chairman Sir, Correspondent Madam, Nalin Sir, Principals, Vice Principals, Chief Guest, Guest of Honor, to the parents, Deans, HOD, to all the members who have gathered here. Uh, one or two minutes extra, please forgive me because I am here for 10 minutes. But in the position, I am four years. So, first of all, I would like to thank each and everyone behind this. Uh, to the SNS, Sri SNS Charitable Trust, SNS Welfare Scheme, because I don't think any other college in and around Coimbatore or in and around Tamil Nadu, I hope, or a colony and all of us, some of Padiko, which or an all company, or highest package, less salary, Wangi Kurte, Vala Wangi Kurte, Angloda talents are right time, la recognize punny, or our opportunity to use punna solely Kurte. I don't think so any other college would do this, but SNS does this for me. I am grateful to each and every corner of my life, to wherever I go, I am grateful to the management, to everyone who supported me. So my first thanks would be to Vijay Kumar sir, because he was the one who put me in this institution. Thank you so much sir. And uh, next, my parents, uh, my grandmothers, and uh, my sister who is sitting over there shooting video for me. Thank you so much to all my friends and to my department. Now uh, like. Department, they used to call me like a rat roaming around the department because department langing is with the auditor. I was like the most favorite kid in my department. So to all the members, not alone one person, to all the members, each and everybody in my department, I would like to thank them. And also, uh, the departments, each and every department in our college, they didn't see me as a child from another department. They just treated me like a student from SNS. They all guided me in such a right way. And why so I'm being here today? Thanks to the DT team, Ashwini ma'am, Benazir ma'am, Vijay Kumar sir, Jagadish sir, Nisha ma'am, everybody. I'm sorry if I've missed any one of your name, but I'll always remember each and every one of you in my hearts. So thank you so much. And to my most lovable seniors who have come all the way along for me, Nagulanna, Darunyaka, Pradipanna, Vishwana, Suryanna, Satishanna, Mitraka, Mohitanna. So everybody, Ganeshanna, they have come a long way for me just to see me awarding this. A lot of members, like they said me, I wish to see you crowned on the annual day. And to all those who have wished that, I am here that I have made it today. And to my lovable juniors, finally. I don't think any juniors would love me to this extent, but the juniors of mine did that. So, I love you all juniors. I will always be there to help and support you. And finally, I owe a lot and lot to my family, SNS family, to my fellow competitors and to everyone here. Thank you so much. this moment i also appreciate our alumni who had actually traveled all the way and also last year winner i could see nagul here congratulations uh, nagul for all the progress that you've been making he's the last year winner who had taken efforts to come please come on join the stage please just for a quick handshake thank you So yeah, so uh, basically my journey is start to start with a small story. So Nakul and I went to the show and I went to the Nakul Pranav is the B.O.G. and I announced it. And then I went to the show and I went to the ARP bronze. So I went to the show and I went to the show and I went to the show. I went to the show and I went to the show and I went to the show and I went to the show. So in the average, I'm not going to say anything about the outstanding, but I'm going to get to the stage in the last stage. So, I'm going to get to the chance and opportunity to get to the stage in the last stage. So, I'm going to get to the chance and opportunity to get to the branding of SNS. How do we brand, how do we do personal branding? I'm going to get to the Nalin Sarity and my SNS brand. So, thanks to SNS for this. And, I'm going to get to the next question. Validation is the key motivation to move a mountain. So, validating people, அவங்களுக் கொண்டு, next to next to நம்மலை மாறி ஒரு நாலு பேரு வருவாங்களா, அப்படின் சொல்லி, people பார்க்கிறது தப்பே கடையாது. So, I take this time to validate everyone who has this, who have the opportunity to present here.
thanks dt team uh, mainly uh, benisir ma'am and ashwini ma'am have been conducting whole uh, bog touch so thank you ma'am and uh, i thank my mother and my friend shar kirtana for uh, here for me and also being a second mother uh, my department staffs uh, mainly narmada narmada ma'am and subhashri ma'am for uh, their validating support and my head of the department sangeeta ma'am thanks for this opportunity and i thank each every one of you for uh, validating this moment thank you all hello so i am gomudi sankar uh, final year biomedical so i need to thank my parents nikki uh, appa perandana so i i wish a happy birthday pa and ena uh, first time college la cheka vandadhu undu enga anna da so avan nikki indha time la avan vandiruka marubadi indha award appo so and no uh, thanks undu enga department hod uh, karthik sir and enga enna vandute eppo மோட்டிவேட் பண்ணி லீவ் போட வச்சு ஈவெண்ட்ஸ் அட்டன் பண்ண வைக்கிற ஜெய்ஸ்ரீ மேம் தேங்க்யூ மேம் அண்ட் எனக்கு நிறைய சப்போர்ட் பண்ண அனுஷா ஆண்டனி அண்ட் எங்கள் பயோமெடிக்கல் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் அண்ட் எங்கள் பாய்ஸ் பாலாறு கோளாறு ஸோ அவங்களுக்கு ஒரு தேங்க்ஸ் சொல்லிக்கிறேன் அண்ட் நான் இப்போ வந்து ரிசர்ச் இன்டர்னா ஐஐடி பட்னாவில் இருக்கேன் ஸோ உங்களுக்கு ஒரே ஒரு இது விஷயம் சொல்லலாம் ரிசர்ச் வந்துட்டு ரெண்டு விதமாக பிரிச்சுருக்காங்க ஒன்று மணி இருந்தால் பண்ண முடியும் இன்னொன்று ஹார்ட் ஒர்க் டெடிகேஷன் நம்ம ஏபிபி அந்த சார் டேரக்டர் சார் சொன்ன மாதிரி ஸோ பேஷன் இருக்கணும் ரிசர்ச்சில் அண்ட் நம்ம வந்துட்டு அதுக்கேற்ற ஜானி ஸோ ரிசர்ச் இட்ஸ் ஜானி ஸோ இட் இஸ் நாட் அ டெஸ்டினேஷன் ஸோ எல்லோரும் ரிசர்ச் பண்ணுங்கள் ஸோ ஆர்என்டியில் எல்லோரையும் பார்க்கலாம் வெரி ப்ளசன் டூ ஒன் ஆல் ப்ளசன் இயர் ஐ எம் விஸ்வா ஃப்ரம் மெக்கானிக்கல் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஃபஸ்ட் ஆஃப் ஆல் தேங்க்யூ டு எஸ்என்எஸ் ஃபேமிலி and uh, thank you to most respected our chairman sir and correspondent ma'am and our principal sir and our most respected vice principal sir administration and academic sir neethu enga vice principal sir just or discussion poi pesittundom appo sir sonnaanga neenga just poi prize vaangradhu mattu or winning illa neenga and the entire process of growth pannale those who are all winners so nee stage la nikkira ellarume winners dhaan thank you so much sir for your continuous support and motivation உங்களுக்கு ஒரு விஷயம்னா நம்ம டெக்னிக்கல் டைரக்டர் சார்ட்டையும் பேசுகிறதுக்கு ஒரு ஃபைவ் மினிட்ஸ் கிடச்சாலோ அதை நினச்சிக்கோங்க இட்ஸ் மோஸ்ட் பெஸ்ட் டைம் சார் சொல்கிற ஒரு ஒரு வேர்ட்ஸும் இவங்களுக்கு ஏதோ ஒரு விதத்தில் ஹெல்ப் பண்ணும் அது மாதிரி டாக்டர் டி தமிழ் செல்வம் சார் டீன் ஆஃப் மெக்கானிக்கல் இன்ஜினியரிங் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் சார்ட்டை பேசுகிறது ஒரு சான்ஸ் கிடச்சாலும் ஒரு ஒரு வேர்ட்ஸும் ஒரு கேரியருக்கு யூஸ்ஃபுல்லாகவோ சார் அது மாதிரி மோட்டிவேட் பண்ணிகிட்டு இருக்காங்க அண்ட் மோஸ்ட்லி தேங்க்ஸ் டு அவர் ஹெட் ஆஃப் த டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் டாக்டர் சி சௌமியா தனலட்சுமி மேம் அண்ட் மை மென்டார் டாக்டர் கௌசிக் சார் என்ன இந்தளவுக்கு மோட்டிவேட் பண்ணி ஃபஸ்ட் இயர்லேருந்து மோல்ட் பண்ணி கொண்டு வந்துட்டுருக்காங்க ஸோ தேங்க்யூ டு கௌசிக் சார் அண்ட் டாக்டர் தர்ணிதரன் சார் அண்டு ஒரு டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் பையனை அடுத்த டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஹெச்ஓடி ஈஸியாக ஆக்சஸ் பண்ணி ஹெல்ப் பண்ணுவாங்கன்னா தட்ஸ் ப்ரௌட் கோஸ் டு டாக்டர் சுப்ரமணியம் சார் ஃப்ரம் ஏரோஸ்பேஸ் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஷுர் சார் ஏன்னா மற்ற டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் பசங்களுக்கும் பிளேஸ்மெண்ட்டுக்கு அவ்வளோ ஹெல்ப் பண்ணுறதுக்கும் பட் ரிசர்ச் பேப்பருக்கு ஹெல்ப் பண்ணுறதுக்கும் டாக்டர் சுப்ரமணியம் சார் வெல்டன் எங்களுக்கு நிறைய ஜாப் பண்ணியிருக்கிறாங்க தேங்க்யூ ஸோ மச் சார் அண்டு டாக்டர் அருண்குமார் சார் ஃப்ரம் ஹிம்ஸ் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் தேங்க்யூ ஸோ மச் சார் அண்ட் ஆல் தி மெக்கானிக்கல் ஃபேக்கல்ட்டிஸ் அண்ட் ஆல் கார்த்திக் சார் ஃப்ரம் மெக்கானிக்கல் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் அண்டு லாஸ்ட் ஒன் மோர் திங் நம்ம காலேஜ் சேர்றது லாஸ்ட்டாக ஒரு ஒன்லி ஒன் ஆண்டர்பினர் அதெல்லாம் பிளேஸ்மெண்ட்டுக்கு போகணும்னு ஆசைப்படுவோம் தட் ஆண்டர்பினர் மைண்ட் செட்டை பர்ஃபெக்டாக கொண்டு வர டிடி டீமுக்கு மோஸ்ட் தேங்க்ஸ் அண்டு பிளேஸ்மெண்ட்டுக்கு மோஸ்ட் ஓவர் கோர் பிளேஸ்மெண்ட்டுக்கு டெஃபினட்டாக ஒரு நல்ல ஜாப் தேடி தந்த நந்தகுமார் சார் தருண்குமார் சார் அண்ட் தர்ஷனா மேம் ஹூ மோல்ட்ஸ் அவர் டீம் டு கிராக் தி ஜிடி அண்ட் சம் டெக்னிக்கல் சப்போர்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் சம் ஜென்ரல் ஹெச்ஆர் ரவுண்ட்ஸ்லாம் கிளியர் பண்ண சொன்னதுக்கு ரொம்ப தேங்க்யூ ஸோ மச் டு டிடி டீம் அண்ட் எல்லா காலேஜிலும் பிளேஸ்மெண்ட் கோஆர்டினேட்டர்ஸ் வந்து காலேஜ் வரைக்கும் வந்து நம்ம நெக்ஸ்ட் காலேஜில் போய் அட்டன் பண்ணுற பிளேஸ்மெண்ட் அது வரைக்கும் வந்து கைட் பண்ணுவாங்கன்னா இட்ஸ் டூ ரேர் ஏன்னா நாங்கள் போன எந்த காலேஜ் பிளேஸ்மெண்ட் கோஆர்டினேட்ஸும் வரல பட் எஸ்என்எஸ் பிளேஸ்மெண்ட் கோஆர்டினேட்ஸ் வந்தாங்க ப்ளீஸ் கிளாக் டு தம் தேங்க்யூ தேங்க்யூ ஸோ மச் டு எஸ்என்எஸ் ஃபேமிலி ஸோ ஹலோ எவ்ரி ஒன்ஸ் ஸோ நான் மைசல் வினோத் குமார் ஃபைனல் இயர் சிஎஸ்சி ஸோ நான் ஷார்ட்டாக சொல்லி முடிச்சிடுறேன் நான் இந்த ஸ்டேஜில் இப்போ நிற்கிறக்கான காரணம் வந்து ஃபஸ்ட்டு வந்து டெக்னிக்கல் டேரக்டர் நலீன் சார் தென் எஸ்என்எஸ் ஃபேமிலி ஸோ மெயினாக நான் தேங்க்ஃபுல் பண்ணுற ஒரு மூணு நேம்ஸ்க்காக தான் நான் வந்து இப்போ இங்கே வந்து நின்னது ஸோ ஃபஸ்ட்டு எங்கள் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஹெச்ஓடி சங்கீதா மேம் ஸோ நெக்ஸ்ட்டு வந்து மை அட்வைசர் நர்மதா மேம் அண்ட் இந்துஜா மேம் ஸோ இவங்க அல்ல மூணு பேர் இல்லைன்னா நான
நான் இந்த அவார்டு வாங்க சத்தியமாக எதிர்பார்க்கல செகண்ட் இயரில் ஒரு என்சிசி கேடட்டாக வாலண்டியரிங்கில் இருந்தேன் தேர்ட் இயரில் ஒரு ஸ்டூடெண்ட்டாக ஆடியன்ஸாக இருந்தேன் இப்போ ஃபைனல் இயரில் லீட் ஆஃப் டுடேவா இங்கே ஸ்டேஜில் நின்றுருக்கேன் வெரி கிரேட்ஃபுல் ஃபார் எவ்ரி ஒன் ஹூ சப்போர்ட் மீ த்ரூ திஸ் என் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் தேங்க்ஸ் நான் கண்டிப்பாக நான் என் பேரண்ட்ஸ்க்கு தான் சொல்லுவேன் ஏன்னா எனக்காக ரொம்ப கஷ்டப்பட்டிருக்காங்க இப்போ கஷ்டப்பட்டு தான் இருக்காங்க அப்புறம் மேனேஜ்மெண்ட்டுக்கு சொல்லுவேன் இந்த ஒரு ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி கொடுத்ததுக்காக அப்புறம் என் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட்டுக்காக என் டீன் ஸ்ரீதர் சார் அப்புறம் என் மென்டர் அண்ட் அட்வைசர் தேங்க் யூ ஃபார் புஷிங் மீ டுவர்ட்ஸ் திஸ் யூ மேட் மீ டூ திஸ் அண்ட் டு அதர் ஃபேக்கல்ட்டி நான் பேர் மென்ஷன் பண்ண விரும்பலை ஆனால் நிறைய பேர் இருக்காங்க எனக்காக ரொம்ப கஷ்டப்படுவாங்க அவங்களுக்கு எல்லாருக்கும் அண்ட் மை ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் மை ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் ஹூ ஆல் சப்போர்ட்டட் மீ டூ திஸ் ஜானி தேங்க் யூ எவ்ரி ஒன் ஹலோ ஐ ஆம் தனுஷ் ஃப்ரம் ஃபைனல் இயர் இசி ஸோ இங்கே ஸ்டேஜில் எங்கள் அப்பா இருக்குன்னு சொல்லி நான் ஆசைப்பட்றேன் அப்பா ஸ்டேஜுக்கு வாங்க ஸோ இந்த அவார்டு ஆக்சுவலாக எனக்கு இல்லை எங்கள் அப்பாவுக்கு தான் ஸோ இந்த அவார்டு பார்த்தீங்கன்னா லீடர் ஆஃப் டுடே அப்படிங்கிறது ஆனால் இந்த லீடரை உருவாக்குனது எங்கள் அப்பா தான் எனக்கான ஃபுல் சப்போர்ட் அண்ட் என்னை ட்ரஸ்ட் பண்ணி நான் என்ன சொன்னாலுமே எது பண்ணாலுமே எனக்கான சப்போர்ட் கொடுத்து ஃபுல்லாக எங்கள் அப்பா தான் ஸோ எங்கள் அப்பா இல்லை அப்படின்னா இந்த ஸ்டேஜில் என்னால் வந்திருக்கவே முடியாது ஸோ தேங்க்யூ அப்பா ஸோ ஐ தேங்க் என்னோட டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஸ்டாஃப்ஸ் எல்லாத்துக்கும் ரொம்ப தேங்க்ஸ் அண்ட் எஸ்பெஷலி சிவசங்கரி மேம் ஏன்னா இந்த ஜேர்னியில் ஸ்டார்டிங் ஃபுல்லாக என் கூட இருந்த என்னோடய எல்லா ஸ்ட்ரகிள்ஸ்லையும் கூட இருந்தாங்க ஸோ அதுவும் இல்லாமல் இந்த எஸ்என்எஸ் காலேஜ் மேனேஜ்மெண்ட்டுக்கு நான் ரொம்ப தேங்க்ஸ் சொல்லிக்கிறேன் ஸோ காலேஜ் ஸ்டார்ட் பண்ணவும் ஒரு ஒரு பிலோ ஆவரேஜ் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்டாக இருந்தால் என்ன என்னால் எதுவும் பண்ண முடியாது அப்படின்னு சொல்லி டிமோட்டிவேட் பண்ண எல்லாம் நிறைய பேர் இருக்காங்க ஆனால் என்னால் முடியும் அப்படின்னு சொல்லி முடித்து சாதிச்சு காமிச்சு கோர் ஃபீல்டில் ப்ளேஸ் ஆகி கோர் ஃபீல்டே ஸ்டார்ட் அப் கம்பெனி வச்சு கோர் ஃபீல்டே வந்து பார்த்திங்கன்னா நான் ஜேர்னியை ரன் பண்ணி போயிட்டுருக்கிறேன் ஸோ என்னோட பேஷன் பார்த்திங்க அப்படின்னா கோர்ஃபீல் ஒரு ஒரு மேனுஃபேக்சரிங் கம்பெனி வந்து உருவாக்குறது அப்படின்னு தான் ஸோ இது எல்லாத்துக்கும் பார்த்தீங்கன்னா எஸ்என்எஸ் அண்ட் எஸ்என்எஸ் சப்போர்ட் அண்ட் என்னோட அப்பாவோட சப்போர்ட் இல்லை அப்படின்னா எதுவுமே முடிஞ்சிருக்காது ஸோ தேங்க்யூ அண்ட் தேங்க்யூ நலின் சார் ஃபார் சப்போர்ட்டிங் ஃபார் எவ்ரி ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி தேங்க்யூ ஸோ குட் ஆஃப்டர்நூன் எவ்ரி ஒன் So, I would like to thank for uh, coming here and for giving me the opportunity, my parents, my teachers, uh, especially Narmada ma'am from CSE department, Sangeetha ma'am from CSE department. Actually, I'm going to push my hand on my hand. I'm not going to push my hand on my hand. So, I'm going to push my hand on my hand. Leon sir uh, from the automobile department, I'm going to push my hand on my hand. I'm going to support my hand on my hand. அண்ட் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஆஃப் ஆல் இது கொடுத்த இந்த அட்டன் பண்ணவே வந்து நளின் சார் எனக்கு ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி கொடுத்தாங்க நான் வந்துட்டு வெளியே எனக்கு கொஞ்சம் செலக்ஷன்ஸ் போகிற மாதிரி இருந்துச்சு ஸோ சார் வந்துட்டு ஓகே ஷெடியூல் பண்ணி தனியாக மீட்டிங் போட்டு எனக்கு ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி கொடுத்தாங்க ஸோ ஐ வில் லைக் டு தேங்க் யூ அண்ட் தேங்க் யூ எவ்ரி ஒன் வில் டேக் த லாஸ்ட் ஃபீட்பேக் ஃப்ரம் வாம் கிரீட்டிங்ஸ் எவ்ரி ஒன் ஐ ஆம் அஸ்வின் Uh, from final year of agriculture engineering department first of all thanks to my parents uh, as a gra- first graduate na vandu inda college ku varren so avangaloda hard work nalada na inge vandu first graduate ah vandu na inge first college enga enga generation la na vandu first graduate ah na ulla varren college la inda four years enakku vandu oru mind experience gain pandrakana chances abilities ellarume kuduthirukanga and second in enga department department of agriculture engineering and both food technology to dean sir dr b shridhar sir and my advisor ma'am madhumadi ma'am and also my mentor hemalatha ma'am and all the faculties of agriculture engineering and food technology ellathukume thanks and also my uh, thanks to a uh, technical director sir nalin sir thank you so much sir and thanks for all the juniors and uh, faculty members thank you Congratulations to all the winners. One of the winners wish is that they will be able to take a wish for their parents to take a group picture. So, uh, while we go to the next uh, award session, I invite all the parents of the winners to come on to the side of the stage. And to take a group picture please. Welcome the winners of the award session. Come on to the side of the stage and to take a group picture please. Welcome all the parents and the accompanying members of the winners. Okay, congratulations to all the members.
Thanks a lot, my dears. Thank you. Thank you. I invite uh, the photographer to capture a beautiful picture of the parents and the winners on the side, please, on the left side. So now we will actually move to All Round Performer Award for the third years. And we will see the teaser, please. And I invite all the ARP third year nominees to come to the stage, please. So I will uh, start with bronze, the award for ARP, third year 2023-24 bronze award goes to Computer Science Department, Danya Shri, Kevin from ECE, Pragadish Biomedical, Rakshai Mechanical, Patu, EC. And if there are parents of the winners, please come on to the join the stage. I welcome the chief guests and the dignitaries to give the award to the five wonderful winners of ARP Bronze. And mentor, please. ECE section, class advisor. ECE section, class advisor and mentor. Ayala thoda HOD you mentor ho andhringa, please.
Thank you, thank you. The bronze winners, please stay back. Now we will move to the silver. The ARP silver third year goes to Harini EC Department, Gokulnath Mechanical Department, Vijayashreen the IT Department, Jayaprakash IT Department, Naveen Mechanical Department. And the parents, please uh, join the stage. Department, I have actually incorrectly mentioned as EC department. Vijay, Vijay, Satish, and HOD. If anybody else wanted to join, please feel free to join. Okay. Students, congratulations to all the members. Is there anybody's mom and dad is coming? Okay. the BOG and uh, leaders of today and tomorrow, winners, I request them, I request them to take the beautiful seats, please. the gold winners are to be announced. The gold ARP goes to mechanical, ECE, CSC, mechatronics and aero department. And the winners are Sriram, Soha, Ahalya, Shakti, Tavaraya Ganapati. I invite the parents and also the department advisors and heads, the lovable ones, to join on the stage, please.
there is a final again a cash award of 1 lakh for their support for the entire all the nominees and winners please wisely utilize the amount okay we'll take a group picture all together and then uh, give the award okay i request the chief guest to give away the award please three members from three teams you can actually one member from each team and the dignitaries to be seated and we can have a group picture together As a custom, we actually give away the unlimited uh, on-duty cards are there, okay? <clears throat> so the students feel privileged to come and go as they feel responsible to use their time wisely. So no more, uh, we need to actually monitor you guys. You take the responsibility, you take the ownership on your life ahead. Please wisely utilize it. These are the cards I am going to hand it over to the ARP BOG team on the side and request all the members and the nominees to collect it. Okay? All right. Hello all. Uh, this is Akalya from third year CSE. Uh, or a bit of thanks Martin, also, like, to my HOD, Sangeeta ma'am. My mentor uh, and uh, advisor, Ramesh sir, Lavanya ma'am and Satish sir to my whole department and the whole department. Amma Angar Kanga, she refused to come on to this stage but Amma this is for you. And this uh, is in seniors, juniors, all of us, our class members, all of us, 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 all of us. English department also, I'm in the MC team, so yeah. Uh, last year I was down and this year I am here as a gold winner. One year can do a lot to you, so start working. Life is to experiment and celebrate. Thank you. 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 And then special thanks to our HOD, Dr. C. Ramakrishnan sir. And render special person in my life whom I met in this college, Satish sir and Vijay sir. If you are here, you are the reason. You are the reason. Parents, could you mean? Like, if you are the award, you are the reason. Sir, you are the reason. Sir, you are the reason. Sir, you are the reason. All the time, like, I give up under stage, they will tell. You are the reason. So, last time, SAD winner, in the time, silver. Next time, hope you are the reason. Thank you. Thank you. So greetings everyone, this is Soha from third year EC. Uh, so first of all, I would like to thank my parents. I would say, proudly say that I am a woman raised by two super women in my life. My Amma and my Chitti, they are over here. Thank you so much for everything. And uh, I would thank my department, uh, department of EC, my HOD ma'am, Geeta Ramani ma'am, Dean sir, Muniraj sir, and my advisor Arun sir for constantly supporting me and my mentor Uma Maheshwari ma'am. And uh, special thanks to DT, DT team for uh, coordinating. And uh, I would like to 
uh, especially thank my friends and last but not the least my special thanks to our technical director dr s nagin nimal kumar sir for bringing out the best in me thank you so much This is Kavin Hari from third year department of ECE department and I have to specially thank to my mom who is the reason for everything and now I have to even didn't get all of me exam and go to Pagam and go to the good day not a chori grombo thank you ma'am in the time of the lot of support for the Naga and special thanks to my department staff and the department in Tandi and could have a travel penny and support man dr. T.R. and Kumar sir remember thank you sir a lot of me thank you and my friends family and third year ECE SX and friends a lot of remember thank you thank you very much Very good afternoon to one and all present here. This is Gokul Nath from third year mechanical engineering. I am feeling very proud and honored to receive this all-rounder performer award. Last year I received all-rounder performer award uh, goal. So this time, this one shows my dedication and my consistency of hard work to receiving this all-rounder performer award. So this one shows that our SNS never forget to recognize ourselves. So as well as SNS recognize ourselves, first of all I thank to management and our chairman sir and our correspondent madam and our technical director sir and our SNS College of Technology and principal sir and vice principals Tamil Selvam sir and uh, Vivekanandan sir and DT team uh, they have put a lot of effects to uh, for this uh, coordinating ourselves. So Benny sir ma'am, Ashwini ma'am and Vijay Kumar sir and I thank SNS Innovation Hub and I thank uh, my department HOD Swamya Dhan Lakshmi ma'am and I thank my mentor uh, Dharani Dharan sir uh, who have been uh, involved me in backbone of my success and I thank all my department faculty members because with, uh, without their uh, supports I cannot be in this uh, particular uh, stage. So thank you all and other department faculty members. So I don't have much time to share journey and uh, story and all. So let me concluding with this. Thank you all for spending your valuable reason. What you wishing? Thank you. Thank you all the ARP third year winners and nominees. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. So we are uh, running almost like 15-20 uh, minutes late. We will try to quickly wind up and then get ready for the culturals. So we will actually uh, see the teaser for ARP, second year uh, nominees. And I request all the second year nominees to take up the stage, please. And the teaser, please.
ஹிஸ்டாரிக்கலாக ஒன்று மட்டும் மாறாதது என்னென்னா பிஓஜி ஒரு லெவலில் இருப்பாங்க அதை விடவும் தேர்ட் இயர் ஏஆர்பி அதுக்கு மேலே இருப்பாங்க செகண்ட் இயர் ஏஆர்பி நாமினிஸ் அதை விட சிறப்பாக இருப்பாங்க இந்த வருஷமும் த சேம் அப்ளைஸ் டு ஆல் த செகண்ட் இயர் நாமினிஸ் தே பின் அவுட் பர்ஃபார்மிங் தெம் செல்ஃப் இன் டேர்ம்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஆல் த திங்ஸ் ஈவன் மோர் தேன் பிஓஜி நாமினிஸ் பட் வெரி வெரி டஃப் கால் இந்த நாமினிஸை வந்து ஃபில்டர் பண்ணுறது அப்படிங்கிறது ஏன்னா ஒவ்வொருத்தருக்கும் ஒவ்வொரு தனித்திறமைகள் இருக்குது அப்படிங்கிறது நான் இன்ட்ராக்ட் பண்ண அந்த ஒன் டே ஹாஃப் டே செஷனில் ஐ குட் சென்சிபிலி விட்னஸ் இட் த்ரூ தேர் பிஹேவியர் அண்ட் கிரேட் பர்சனாலிட்டி தட் வி ஹாவ் யூ கைஸ் ஆர் த டிஎன்ஏ ஆஃப் எஸ்என்எஸ் ஸோ ஐ எம் டோட்டலி ப்ரவுட் ஆஃப் எவ்ரி இண்டிவிஜுவல் ஒன் ஆஃப் யூ ஹியர் ப்ரெசென்ட் ஹியர் ஸோ த வின்னர்ஸ் ஃபார் bronze arp second years goes to computer science department triple e department agri ec satya from ec swati from agri keetra from triple e ramani from csc i request the dignitaries on the stage to give away these awards we will not hesitate uh, to have you on the stage to have uh, broad and wonderful minds to sns family what goes to the silver arp goes to ai ml department biomedical auto mechatronics puja from biomedical sanjay from auto sahil from mechatronics alna from ai ml i request anybody who is loud ones or the leaders of the leaders on the stage please join the stage please to mechanical department food technology computer science ai ml sara from ai ml avanti vaishnavi and madan i request the parents and the department heads and the men 
sectors. If they are there, please join. Madan is a mentor and class advisor. Even a lot of class advisor, HOD is a stage. Seed fund, <coughs> I let all the, uh, the rest of the nominees to collect from the chief guest. All the nominees who had not won the award, please come forward to collect the one lakh award. Please come forward. I request the dignitaries to give away the one lakh cash award, which they can use it for their seed fund. all the members to wisely utilize the one lakh for a cause. First of all, your parents are very sorry. They told me that I'm going to get to the house. I'm going to get to the house because I'm going to get to the house. So, I'm going to get to the house. I'm very sad. I'm very happy to be here. So, they're all very sorry. First of all, I want to thank our institution. I want to thank our correspondent, ma'am, chairman, sir, and technical director, and our vice principal, sir, our dean, Tamil Chilvam, sir, and our HOD, ma'am, Saumiya Dhanalachi, ma'am, and my golden advisor, P. Janagaratnam, sir, and V. Kartik, sir, and uh, third advice I will be Karthik sir, mostly break period in our cabin. So my department faculty will thank you all. And my uh, department will thank you all for the physical education department. Dhinagaran sir, I will thank you all. And Naveen sir, Nadrajan sir, Asif sir, Nalin ma'am. And then my English ma'am, Anita Melbina ma'am, I will thank you all. And my alumni, uh, Kannan, 2016 passed out on EC department. So all of the alumni, the alumni lunch is very helpful sir. Like our college students are doing a lot of things in the college. Jeevika, Gauri, Pradish, Siva Pradip, Arish Babu, Nivas, Deepan, I thank you all of them. And my classmates and my team, my brothers. Just go to the first place. Sir, short and sweet. My brother Sunil and Tamil Alagan, Devi Sanjana, my teammate, Nitishwaran. 
and uh, DT team ke na or uh, thank ponno na Darani ma'am ke first of all rombo peri thank ponno and Benz ma'am and Tamil Chelvam sir and Nisha ma'am. Yung all thik ma'am na rombo thank ponno. Thank you all rombo time arthira na nikra. Naano culture us rombo eat ponder kya. Thank you all. So hello everyone. Happy morning to one and all present here. This is Avanti from CAC department. எல்லாருக்குமே வந்துட்டு எல்லாருமே சப்போர்ட் பண்ணுவாங்க கண்டிப்பாக ஃபர்ஸ்ட் அண்ட் ஃபார்மோஸ்ட் ஃபேமிலி அண்ட் அன்ஃபார்ச்சுனேட்லி நோ ஒன் ஃப்ரம் மை ஃபேமிலி இஸ் ஹியர் டுடே பட் எஸ்என்எஸ் வந்து எனக்கு ஒரு செகண்ட் ஃபேமிலியாக எப்பயுமே இருந்திருக்கு மை அட்வைசர் ஜனனி மேம் மை ஹெச்ஓடி சங்கீதா மேம் அண்ட் மை டீம்மேட் தட் இஸ் இர்ஃபான் அஹமத் அண்ட் மை சீனியர் அஸ்வன் அந்த மாதிரி நிறைய பேர் சொல்லிகிட்டே போகலாம் இந்த மாதிரி எல்லாருமே எனக்கு வந்து நிறைய சப்போர்ட் பண்ணியிருக்காங்க என்ன தான் வந்துட்டு ஃபேமிலி வந்து நம்மளுக்கு சப்போர்ட் பண்ணாலுமே த செகண்ட்ரி அதாவது த செகண்ட் ஹோம் வேர் வி ஸ்டடி அண்ட் லேர்ன் திங்ஸ் நம்மளை நம்மளே நம்மளோட பொட்டென்ஷியலை கண்டுபிடிக்க வைக்கிறது வந்து நம்மளோட எஜுகேஷன் பேக்ரவுண்ட் மட்டும்தான் ஸோ அந்த மாதிரி எஸ்என்எஸ் இஸ் மை செகண்ட் ஹோம்னே சொல்லுவேன் ஸோ திஸ் அவார்ட் ஆக்சுவலி கோஸ் டு எஸ்என்எஸ் இன்ஸ்டியூஷன்ஸ் தேங்க்யூ wish to be the change you see yourself so hello everyone i'm keerthana from second shibli so na ellarku thanks solikinu nenikira whoever was with me in this journey uh, so first of all i would like to thank our uh, institution for giving this wonderful opportunity and my parents and my sister who's always been with me and idu vandu solliyagunu haryana from mct department he was an immense support for me avar illa na inda award kandippa illa nu solluva so it was it is very special to me uh so thank you okay hello everyone i am ramni lakshmi priya from csc department and uh, first i want to thank sns institutions and my hod sangeeta ma'am and my advisors uh, selvakumar sir and subhashri ma'am for their constant support uh, like enikku enga family varamudila but ana live na link send panirken so avanga paathirupanga so thank you so much for my friends like girija pragashna uh, shruti for their constant support thank you thank you so much so good morning everyone i don't want to take much of your time so na vandittu first arp apply pandren sonna podu நிறைய பேர் என்கிட்ட சொன்னது நீங்கள் இது வந்துட்டு டான்ஸ் மட்டும் தானே ஆடியிருக்கீங்க அதை தவிர என்ன பண்ணியிருக்கீங்க அப்படின்னு சொன்னான்னு கேட்டாங்க ஸோ அங்கே தான் நான் நினச்சேன் நான் பண்ணது வெளியில் தெரியல டான்ஸ் ஆடுறது மட்டும் தான் வெளியில் தெரிஞ்சிருக்கு அப்படின்னு ஸோ ஐ டுக் திஸ் ஹஸ் அன் ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி டு எக்ஸ்பிரஸ் ஃபுல் மை செல்ஃப் ஸோ ஹியர் ஐ எம் வின்னிங் த கோல் ஹியர் ஐ எம் வெரி தேங்க்ஃபுல் டு மை ஹெச்ஓடி லதா மேம் அண்ட் மை மென்டா ஹூ கான்ஸ்டன்ட்லி கேவ் இஸ் சப்போர்ட் ஸ்டீஃபன் சார் அண்ட் பார்கவி மேம் அண்ட் சம் ஆஃப் மை சீனியர்ஸ் இளந்தலன் ஃப்ரம் அக்ரிகல்ச்சர்ஸ் அண்ட் நவீன் ஃப்ரம் மெக்கானிக்கல் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் தேங்க்யூ everyone i am vaishnavi from secondary btech food technology so first of all nam institution ku thank panikiren inda opportunity ena kudutadukku ena recognize panikiru and tv sir great thanks to you ena kandipa recognize panirukku and inga vandu na or few people mention pannu nenikiren so first vandu krithika ka krithika ka illana na inniki inda stage la arp ah inga nindru pana kandipa theriyadhu krithika ka ku thank you thank you thank you so much and second ah vandu arif sir college starting la irundhu ippo varaikum avlo support avlo motivation kuduthite irukkaru அண்ட் அவரை கண்டிப்பாக நாங்கள் மென்ஷன் பண்ணி ஆகணும் அண்ட் கண்டிப்பாக இவங்களை மென்ஷன் பண்ணி ஆகணும் மை கிளாஸ் அட்வைசர் அதிகா மேம் அவங்க சப்போர்ட் இல்லைனா இவ்வளோ தூரம் வந்திருப்பேன் என்னென்னு தெரில அண்ட் மை தேங்க் மை டீம் மெம்பர்ஸ் அவந்தி சாரா அண்ட் மதன் டீமாக வந்து பண்ணியிருக்கோம் கண்டிப்பாக நாங்கள் இதை எதிர்பார்க்கவே இல்லை ரொம்ப பெரிய அச்சீவ்மெண்ட் அண்ட் ஐ டு தேங்க் மை கிளாஸ்மேட்ஸ் அண்ட் மை ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் தேங்க் யூ தேங்க் யூ எவ்ரிவன் ஸோ குட் ஆஃப்டர்நூன் எவ்ரி ஒன் ஐ எம் மொஹமத் சாஹில் ஸோ ஐ வுட் லைக் டு தேங்க் மை பேரண்ட்ஸ் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் then our faculty ma- mentors uh, samshivam sir and swati ma'am and i should really thank our senior hari prasad rajgopal and sanjay so these two seniors were always support you and help me in any conditions and i i would like to thank my friend who supported me in any situation so i would like to say a quote catch the wind of opportunity and sail into your self, sa- safe harbor thank you Hello everyone. A warm good afternoon to one and all. I am Alna PM from second year AIML. I am so honored and privileged to get this uh, prize and I dedicate to all of my competitors who uh, whomever was there with me, whom whomever I work with. 
I, I have a grateful thank, uh, thank you for each and every member of SNS family, including DD team, Nalin sir, is my greatest inspiration. Uh, I should say this process ha has a great impact to every child that has been gone through this process. So I appreciate everyone to take part of it, to take consider it seriously and uh, uh, be a part of it and have a wonderful journey. It's, it's worth it and I have to say it from my heart because it will improve you in many ways you just can't think of when you are in comfort zone. Break the comfort zone and let's do it. Thank you. So, good afternoon everyone. This is Sanjay from Second Year Automobile. First of all, I would like to thank uh, SNS family, especially the DD team, Ashwini ma'am, Benazir ma'am and Vijay sir. And uh, a special thanks to our department HOD, Dr. Sendhul Kumar Krishnasamy. So, because I have a moment to support the persons. And a special thanks to my friends uh, who are sitting there. Who are sitting there and having uh, an area with the support. So, thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. So, I am Pooja from Second Day Biomedical. So, uh, short term, I would like to thank uh, whoever traveled with me, especially my co mates, Gopinath and Linkeshwaran, and my teammates and my mentor and my tutor and especially my HOD, Mr. Kartik sir. Thank you everyone for providing me this opportunity. Thank you so much. So, guest here, I'm going to wait for you. Okay. Sorry uh, that uh, our students been very expressive on thanking their contributing minds of SNS. Our hearty congratulations to all the members who had been here on the stage who had kept me engaging, who had actually <coughs> shown that Urthurade Kanna Pata Adalanda and the Weir and the Dina Romba Serapa Sadiki Kudya Shakti Abdim Banga Ingirka stage in the Ella students or the Kanlio and the Urverio and the energy. I was able to witness it. Or a Karagoshatode Latium, congratulate Panirla Katasia or Visula at Chalama. All right. So again, again we have unlimited OD cards for all the members present here. Enjoy, enjoy the culturals. Thanks a lot, my dear boys and girls. Thank you so much. Thank you. I will let the next members to take up. Thank you, everyone. Gratitude for past unlocks the fullness of life and turns what we have into enough and more. After long sequential efforts taken by each and every member of Annual Day Celebration team that had helped to attain a grand success, to express the gratitude, we have Dr. P. Vivekanandan, sir, Vice Principal Academics. Highly respected dignitaries honored of the dais, a warm and pleasant afternoon to one and all gathered here on the occasion of our 22nd uh, annual day celebrated today here. I feel uh, greatly honored and highly privileged to propose a vote of thanks on the occasion of our annual day. First, I would like to thank the Lord Almighty for bringing all of us here together and to witness the annual day celebrations here. Without uh, his blessings, I think this annual day would not have been this grand success. So gratitude is not in the words, but in the heart which expresses it. On that note, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to our highly distinguished chief guest of today's function, Mr. G.N.V. Subarao Sar, Global Head of Operations, IM&S, Process Automation Business Area, ABB Bengaluru, for accepting our invite in a very short, short, note, uh, short time, despite his busy engagements and also gracing this occasion and delivering the CBS address today. And as he mentioned in his address that uh, every student should focus upon lifelong learning. I think I, I let inform sir that it is one of our graduate attributes and our students will live up to our expectations, sir. So thank you very much for your gracious presence and valuable address, sir. Thank you, sir. 
Next, my hearty thanks goes to our distinguished guest of honor of today's function, Mrs. Chandrasekharan, Associate Director, Cognizant Coimbatore, for accepting our invite to be the guest of honor of today's function and his valuable and insightful and motivational address. And also, he outlined the, uh, the uh, revealed the secret of how to get into the CTS in a very short and sweet terms. Thank you, sir. Next, I'd like to thank our chairman, Dr. S.M. Subramaniam, sir, who is the guiding force behind our every success and also for his valuable and motivational guidance and his kind words of appreciation. Thank you, Mr. Sir. I would like to express my sincere gratitude to our correspondent, Dr. S. Rajalakshmi Madam, for all her motivational guidance in all through our activities. Thank you, Madam. I would like to extend my sincere gratitude to our technical director, who always thinks, who always works towards the betterment of each and every, every, one, every stakeholder of our SNS family, always, the native design thinker, for his constant encouragement in all of our activities and his great motivation. Thank you very much, sir. Next, I'd like to thank our director, Dr. V.P. Arnachalam, sir, whose timely guidance has made this function a grand success. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank our dynamic principal, Dr. S. Chandur Pandian, sir, for his impressive annual report, which has a lot of activities and also accomplishments, and his constant involvement in all our day-to-day all -day activities and his continuous motivation, and also the kind of freedom which normally he gives to everybody. That makes this event a grand success. Thank you, Mr. Sir. It gives me great pleasure to extend my hearty thanks to Mohan Narayanan, sir, Head of Operations, and our institutional IQAC team, and DT team especially, and the Innovation Up team, so far resulting the responsibility of grooming our uh, talented students. My special thanks goes to our Administrative office, Officer, Mr. Mardachalam, sir, and his team. Further, I would like to express my deep sense of gratitude to our Vice Principal Admin, Dr. P. Tamasalum, sir, for his motivation. Thank you, sir. We are greatly thankful to Dr. A. Viswanathan, sir, Dr. T. Prakash, and Dr. Manjula Devi, madam, and their team, who are the coordinators of this annual day, who started uh, annual day preparatory works for the two months from uh, the then, and also their wonderful planning and execution of the activities, which led to the successful conduction of today's event. Thank you all. I thank all our deans and heads of various departments for their constant support and timely cooperation towards all the activities leading to the successful conduction of this annual day, 2024. I also thank our all teaching and non-teaching staff members, office staff, and their, for their meticulous planning, execution, and contributing all they can towards the successful conduction of this day. My special thanks to present media for coverage of our events. Last but not the least, I would like to thank my dear, highly enthusiastic and self-motivating student friends and invited parents who have been with us all through the years and I hope they will be with us for the years to come also. Once again, I thank you all. Thank you. Thank you, sir. All is well that ends well. Now let us all rise up for the national anthem. Janagana mana adhinayaka jayahe Mata bhagya vidhata Punjab Sindh Gujarat Maratha Kavida Utkala Vanga Vindya Himachala Yamuna Ganga Utchala Jaladhita Ranga Tava Shubha Name Jage Tava Shubha Ashish Mage Gahe Tava Jaya Gatha Janagana Mangala Dayak Jaya He Bharat Bhagya Vidhata Jaya He Jaya He Jaya He Jaya 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 He I request everyone to kindly sit down. I request everyone to kindly sit down. Thank you, dignitary staff and students for making this function a grand success. Have a pleasant day and thank you. 
we from the NC team are extremely grateful for all your patience. Thank you guys. So this is Akalya, Amir and Sai. Thank you. The cultural program starts from 2 o'clock, so everyone are requested to assemble here at this stipulated time. I repeat, the cultural program will begin by 2 o'clock, so 